Can start with the winners round one. Squeeze Theorem versus Avadani. Let's get into it. No fear from Squeeze. This jump nair from ledge that Avadani keeps doing. <laughs> keeps just getting a little, like, couple percent on the squeeze and disrupting his, his ledge guard. He keeps doing it. It keeps working. Good, not trying to punish him landing on the platform, because why would he? Okay, goes for the tail punch and he doesn't get it. Squeeze, maintaining his cool. He's the neutral get up. And Avadani takes game one. If I wasn't busy, like with people recording stories, I'd go up there and I bet there's something up there in the storage, in the loft. Okay. But. Woo! What happened these first 30 seconds? I looked away and they're both <laughs> two stocks. Damn.
He's taking game two. Do you have a table? Uh, uh, yeah. You, you, you play with the Pokemon? Where's your table? Oh, I didn't bring one. But the thing is, everybody forgets them, so I kind of run out. Uh, uh, this is the station on my Does it have uh, the, what is it called? The little controls on the side? Yeah. No, I would connect that one. With that. Fire! Station 5! Xenon! Skylander Dude 12! Station 2! little combo takes it Bonchui Axto Station One I didn't even see that until now. What's up, Namek? Sure did. I don't know what the fuck a Boonchuri is, but you're on Station 1. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, they coming in? They coming in? The comms are coming in? And they're going to get to experience the nice wonderfulness of Techni Sport Gaming chairs? They are in for a treat, our commentators. What's up? I'm talking to you guys right now. <laughs> you guys can watch it back. And you'll just... watch nothing the bad, don't worry. There's nothing bad. Damn, you just... We're going to be like, dude, you just... up our Nice. Dang! Oh, what is this? From the gaming chair spot. Oh, yes. Nice. Techni Sport Games. Use wow. code GAMESYNC at technisportusa.com <laughs> for 10% off your order. 10% off your sponsor. Oh yeah, you got the little oh. graphic that we can like flash to every now and then. Oh, so, yeah. oh no, I see the, I see the Techni. Nice. Okay. Hell yeah. Axto uh, versus Bonchui. Bonchui? Bonchui? All right. What do you guys, you guys, what do you guys think of Bunchui? Is what the fuck is Bunchui? Well, Actually, Ch Chui is a nickname for Jesus, is what I know. Ooh, right. And then, and then Boon, I understand as the actual word. It just means like, a, like a plentiful moment, right? Wait. Is Bunchui? Oh, from from where? Bunchui is the last name of a character from Amphibia. Wait, the you Disney Channel show? Are, are, That's where I know. Are, okay. are you are you looking it up or? Wait, wait. wait. I think I think I think it's too? potential anime character. Man, but, what did you say it was like the translation version? Well, well, I I was literally Just translating it, and I, and I think I went too deep. No, wait, what <laughs> would, no, what would that be though? If we if we were to combine that? No, if you were to literally translate. It. Hey, Zeus's boon. Hey, Zeus's boon. Pretty much. Okay. His treasure. Yeah, I could be it. Jesus is treasure. Yes. Yeah. And then we're gonna ask him. That's he's a little self aggrandizing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but he's gonna be like, no, it's an anime character, like. <laughs> It's actually best wife. That'd be a good robber. Like, that'd be a good sword. like. Oh, uh, Bunchui is. Uh, Alright, cool. I think it's from Amphibia. We have, more, Sora. we have more Sora representation. Oh, yeah, the other one is Axe. That'd be a good one of those games. Like, is this a Kanye quote or a Kanye quote? Is this an anime character or uh, something from the Bible? <laughs> or something from the Bible. <laughs> Wrong, it's Neon Genesis. It's both. <laughs> it's both. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, look at this. So we are in winner's round one, and I'm assuming we sound good here. I mean, we were able to hear Casey. For sure. So we're chilling. So what's up, everyone? We are back after our long hiatus. For sure, it has been a minute. Summer got really busy for us. Summer is the busy season, isn't it? It definitely is. But we got Boonchui versus Axto. Rob versus Sora, which honestly, not something you get to see every day. Yeah, right. It's an interesting thing to, to see and experience. And Curb, you, you're the Sora player here. How is this matchup in your head? In my head, I feel like I win this. But I don't actually know. Is it because Rob is big? It's because Rob is big. <laughs> you, gotta say the, you gotta say the meme. <laughs> say it. <laughs> Rob is big and Sora has a key sword. So. Oh man, getting a little overzealous with that down smash at ledge. Uh, Bunchu is definitely playing Sora at a, at a super fast pace, much faster than I'm used to seeing, if I'm being honest. Which is pretty good, but uh, Ooh. I'm still not really being able to oh. reply to oh. all the stuff that Bunchu is just throwing out. Gonna get that nice back air confirmed off the freeze. That was absolutely incredible, like the usage, the placement, just knowing when to use all your projectiles. Oh, yeah. Even nice. mixing up the recovery with the drift out right there, it looks like Axto is getting a little desperate right now. And we know, uh, and, and we know, Bunchu is definitely gonna take advantage of that. You don't want to get caught in these nair loops, dude, because you can do what, like thirty something damage, like per nair loop. <laughs> I'd like 30, 40 for sure, if you, if you do it right. Yeah, I like the evasiveness that we're seeing coming out from Axel right now, but Bunchu is still taxing him right now. He's steadily adding on this damage. Oh man, nah, his, his defense, the defense nice. diligence is too strong right now from Bunchui. Axel's gonna have to mix it up if they want to make uh, some kind of impact. Yeah, Axel was figuring out how to get out of those near combos there a little bit, but Bunchui just switching it up. Rob is big. <laughs> that Rob was, is big. That was absolutely and ridiculous. Sonic how did so Blade's hitbox is messed up. Oh man, that was absolutely ri He was recovering from below stage and still hit Rob through the platform. Oh, yeah. What? Oh yeah. What? Death. Yeah. I've been hit by that too many times. <laughs> <laughs> you get the hup hup to back off, and they're gone. <laughs> the hup hup to back off. <laughs> That's how I would memorize it too. Alright, and uh, game number one went to Boon Chui. Uh, 
we are here in a double elimination bracket. So what that means, folks, is everyone starts off in winners. You can lose once, you get knocked down to losers. Once you are eliminated from there, then that is bye-bye into the tournament. So we are currently in winners round one. So even if one of these players is eliminated, they have one more shot. One more shot to win it all. But we got Sora in the final form. And we're also going to Hollow Bastion. I don't know. Is it? Oh, man. The Nair Loops. The Nair Loops. He got him to 21, even as uh, evasive Axto was being right there. Is it Star GG or Smash? It's, uh, it's Star GG. Yeah, dude, they, they rebranded a few years ago. Okay. Dude, look at this. Nah, this is this is messed up. This is, you're, you're just bullying him, bro. <laughs> nah, dude. Yeah. He's not going to sleep at night Like after <laughs> after knowing yeah, the, the things you just did to him right there. Okay. So at least fully charged Rod Laser gets rid of Faraga. We know that at the very least now. But dude, he is piecing him up right now. Like sure, they're trading a little bit, but uh, Bunchu is definitely the one uh, most in uh, in control right now. Seems like he very well like understands the spacing, the range that he needs to be at, being able to land all these aerials, causing devastation to the big Rob. Look so at that. That freeze gonna be hidden. Too many of these projectiles have landed. The one that he hasn't landed too much is the thunder. Yeah. He's got that fire and the freeze on lock, but Axto knows the spacing. Oh, let's see. Is he going to be able to make anything off of this edge yeah, guard? That's wow. A, that's the side. Okay, cool. This could be a stroke of luck for Boon, uh, for Axto right here. Maybe yeah, uh, Boon. Sleep, but Axto <laughs> is a killer. For sure. That was amazing. Sora is a broken character. Dude, Sora. I, I don't know where I would put him, if I'm being honest, but he's definitely within the time. He, he's a broken like, for, character that you have to put a lot of time into. For sure. So, it's hard to place him, I feel like. Oh, man, look at these Nair Loops. He's just got him on. Bro, when does yep. the trap end? <laughs> when does the trap end? You're in the mall. You're in the mall. Look at that. I like how he uses projectiles to stall off stage and get yeah. onto ledge. Look, he's continuing it. Ooh. <laughs> he's, he's getting caught in his own rhythm, so he, he really yeah. thought he was going to be able to land that, that grab. Oh, wow. Even almost trying to parry that laser. I'm really... The defense diligence from uh, Boon Chui. Yeah, they know when to shield him. Ooh, let's see. What's the conversion? Ah, so far they haven't been able to deal with that. Nope. They're still going to recover. Made it back onto the ledge. And wow, without even challenge or question. But uh, Axo still able to air dodge out of that. Yep. And... <laughs> You cannot stay on the platform above Sora. No, no matter sir. what you do, you need to get on the you ground. You need to know what to do about an up air from Sora. You need to put Sora the in the air. <laughs> yeah. Because Sora's down air is garbage. For sure. <laughs> it's the only move that's that's his bad one. <laughs> <laughs> it's only good as like a mix-up. Yeah, definitely. I can see that. Ooh, getting a little greedy trying to land that up smash right there. Testing the defense of Boon Chui, but we know he's got it on lock. Axto's yes, with That back air is going to do it for sure. Clean as hell. The gyro into the back air. The precision, the movement, the dedication. It's uh, definitely something to admire. Ooh, a nice fair right there, but fast fall. And unfortunate in SD in game number two. It's going to be 2 0 Boonchui over Axto. Oh, wow. Boonchui definitely made him think he was going to back air. Yeah, that was. I'm about to play on stream right now, but what did you say? Don't say clap is gonna clap, right? Well, your name is Clap? It is Clap. Oh, that's good. <laughs> okay. I'm sure you've gotten a lot of the Clap references then, too, right? I'm just saying, I'm, yeah, I'm just saying. You can say I'm doing it. But, yeah. <laughs> but don't get clapped. But don't get clapped, and we won't get say clapped. it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. No. If anything, we'll call you Cheeks if you're getting clapped. <laughs> <laughs> Versus Clapper. A versus Clap? Hell yeah. That's Apparently Clap has never fought it before. Oh, and, um, fun time. Uh, All right. Uh, <laughs> it's a game to watch. Uh, uh, yeah. Especially his caliber. You you should uh, shake his hand already. Just no, say just, no, no, no. Just, just, no, no, no. Just, Get out of there. <laughs> <laughs> just don't expect it. Anymore. Yeah. Oh, I'm not yeah. typing at all. And uh, Abe is quite ruthless. He he knows his combos. He oh, knows yeah. his routes. You think he's gonna let you out of the trap? Hell no. He's, he's gonna get you to anywhere from 40 to 60 damage and then have you recontemplating you playing this game. Oh. Yeah, actually, I feel like that's what a good game of watch is gonna want to do. Damn. <laughs> Clap, get shorter. Got a gamer slouch. Yeah, drop bro. The, drop the chair, drop the chair. Drop the chair! Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, we can only see part of the face, but we got Clapper going up against Abe. 
that is the resident game and watch of freaking menace and down here in Jordan's. southern california a fantastic player and of course the game and watch one of the undisputed uh, best characters within the game for sure yeah he's just like also the lightest character in the yeah game. before dlc he was he was one of the best yeah. for sure actually all right, let's go ahead and see how these players uh, go ahead and get settled in. But real quick, guys, this is Sink or Swim 176. 176. We made it this far, and it is absolutely uh, beautiful to see. I'm going to go ahead and type exclamation point bracket in here so you guys are able to pull it up and follow it uh, with us as well. Bracker. Go ahead, throw in bracket. And then you guys can see we got Sink or Swim, and we also got Sync Up Saturdays. That's our Super Smash Brothers Ultimate Tournaments that happen on Thursdays and Saturdays. And then we also got Synchronicity, which to my knowledge, ooh, it's gonna be Link versus Game & Watch, hell yeah. All right, let's go ahead Let's go ahead and see him where they started off as well. Oh man, this, if anything, is gonna be a brutal matchup for Clapper. Oh, nice. Link has the Tears of the Kingdom thing. Oh yeah, that reminds oh, yeah. me. I, I still, I still need to send, uh, send you some mods. Yeah, actually. <laughs> and, hey, to find mods. And uh, I think, uh, I believe at Gommel, we just saw a Link in top eight by the name of Orange. So we are seeing some uh, Link representation out there somewhat. So good, good to see this character getting some form of shine. But like, anytime you play him online, uh, it makes you rethink the game for sure. Yeah. One hundred percent. Oh man, Abe just up to his usual uh, shenanigans right now. It's just up to Clapper to see how they will adapt. Yeah, he's definitely just keeping him on that ledge, not wanting to move back too much. But like, Clapper. Link cannot close the distance right now. Able to get the grab, back throw him off stage. Alright, what's the plan here? Unfort Ooh, nice, being able to land another grab. A Link landing so many grabs, that's not something I'm used to seeing. Yeah, actually, especially not this one. Oh man, Abe just seems to be ready. Got the defense ready and on lock. Filling up the bucket. Oh. Throwing out those random mess smashes, trying to see if he can catch a just game and watch unawares. You just parry into the player. Yeah. Oh yeah, not now that you've been playing Street Fighter, you're thinking about parry. <laughs> you're thinking about parry in a different about way. What to actually do when fighting him? <laughs> oh, beautiful edge guard from Abe right there, guaranteed down air off ledge or off stage. Yeah, I actually I was thinking about it. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, let's do it. It's on Fridays? Yeah. yeah. Nice. I thought it was on it's a, it's, it's. Is it Street Fighter, Tekken, and Guilty Gear? All in the same It's like whatever is. Whatever like, it's. Most people want to play. So right oh, now okay. it's Street Fighter 6 and. Uh, and they play Tekken and Guilty Gear. Yeah. But I don't yeah. know if they always do brackets for those. Oh, okay. I see. What's the what's the attendance for, for, for those events? Since Street Fighter 6 came out, it's gotten bigger and bigger. Yeah, I know. Uh, I'm assuming. I think they had like 25 or something. Nice. Did it go? Uh, Hell yeah. It was a little small, but... Yeah. Yeah, what, uh, what, what happened to Grand Blue? Uh, I don't know if they still play it, but might just have gotten, you know, not enough interest. Yeah. I was going to say that that one is a pretty niche fighting game. It's a very niche game. I honestly only know that game because of you, because like you showed it. Yeah. I only know it because of the like Persona yeah. plays Blue Cross game that I play. We are definitely playing the War of Attrition, and uh, I believe the fun fact that we heard before this is uh, this is Clapper's first time. First time in uh, playing a bracket oh, against man. Abe. I think oh, against Abe. Well, uh, GG's, man. I think you're uh, actually experiencing what it feels like. Oh, wow, at the very end, like the final hits of up B, but I don't know if Clapper's going to be able to get back. Abe is just relentless. Yeah, he does got the ledger locked down with Game Watch right now. He's absolutely ready with that with that up B at all times. What is that called? Is it like parachute? Or what? Oh, it's called, um... They're all named after, like, the Game Watch games. Dude, what a hard call out from Abe right there, knowing damn well he was going to land right there in perfect F-tilt chair to get him out of the way. Like no. Fire, like, fire, fire escape. Fire escape. Okay. Ah man. That's just like chef. Dude, if we're if we're talking about nair loops with Sora, the nair loops are only continuing oh, with Game and Watch mean, yeah. right now. Why do you think it was so easy for me to pick up Sora? I feel like I feel like we need to see Palu as well for some oh, more yeah. for some yeah, more yeah. nair loopage. All my Smash characters have the nair for sure. <laughs> All right, and welcome to the Blender Clapper. Oh, nice. Really good punish right there. You can actually see an audible or a visible reaction. <laughs> it was probably audible. Yo, Abe trying to play footsies right now. Actually. Unfortunately, a chair is not longer than a sword, my friend. <laughs> not in this game. Not in this game. Maybe in other games. Yeah. <laughs> I, I can definitely see it. 
Wow, he had enough time to drop through the platform and land the bomb. The end lag on Link is uh, is pretty ridiculous. Yeah. He's a very nice. difficult character to pilot. But here we are. Triple digits on the last stock. Can Clapper make the comeback? Clapper got to play out of his mind for a little bit here. Oh, nice tech, but unfortunately no jump. And with 1.2% damage on Abe stock, uh, surprisingly, being able to go last stock, so props to Clapper right there, but that is Abe going up one yeah. game. He did a, he did a yeah. great job for being the first time playing against Abe. Yeah. If he's able to successfully land the, the, the cheese, you know, yeah, like the random F smashes in like the middle of neutral. <laughs> and, and he did the uh, yeah. falling up there too. I, I yeah. could see Link taking out Game of Watch at like 70% pretty 100%. easy. You get the right sword hits. Oh, yeah. He's gone. And he had uh, pretty good uh, whiff punishes uh, with uh, Link's up being, especially like on yeah, the ground. Right. That move is devastating. It does a, does a heck load of damage. He's got the grabs too. Oh, yeah. So so we can we can definitely see signs of Fundy. There's signs of life within Clapper. Signs of Fundy. Can you see the Fundies, you know? Oh, wow. You know, I actually never paid attention to that. If you throw the boomerang out and then you run away from it, it'll actually come. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It like, goes to Link's position. Yeah. So you can definitely just use that to, like, yeah. pop them up. It seemed almost unintentional, but so unintentional that it seemed intentional. For Clapper, you know? <laughs> like, I actually don't know what it was. It's definitely intentional. Oh, man. If you're a good Link player, it should be. Yo, like. look at the spacing and the distance that he's actually playing this at. Like, Clapper maintaining the good. patience. I like it. I like what I'm seeing from Clapper. For sure. Ooh, nice, nice get-up attack to create that distance. Oh, oh yeah. An unfortunate an SD from uh, <laughs> from Clapper. Oh yeah, audible. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, unfortunate situation. You are now a stock behind on Game and Watch, and that's uh. Oh. Game and Watch is a, oh was, that's a Playing Game and Watch is the war of attrition. Are you ready to uh, death by a thousand cuts? Because that's definitely what he's gonna do to you. <laughs> Oh no, he landed that down smash. He should be able to cover it here. Wow, didn't land that down smash and he was recovering off stage. Ooh! Nice. Beautiful nice placement of the F smash right there. Clapper with the comeback. Right, now we're down to two to two stocks. Clapper with the clapback. Oh, there you go. <laughs> there you go. To not be a yeah, we, we, we've been asked not to make typical clap jokes. <laughs> oh, man, but Abe is here yeah, those back with 0% uh, with damage. Wow, with a reverse falling there. Absolutely ridiculous, dude. Abe, Abe is very spot dodge friendly right now, for sure. Wow, using the very last hits of that back air and then using this... What's it called? It's not called bacon. What's it called? It's bacon. It is bacon? <laughs> no. It's pretty much just bacon. Yeah. It's like... Chef yeah, Chef. It's called Chef. You're right. Nah, man. Abe is absolutely tricky when coming back to ledge. Look at that. He just laid out so many traps. Out and then look, using Chef. Ooh, I thought he was going to use Chef. I thought Chair was the confirm, right? I thought Chef to I chair. think he was reading a, an air dodge or something. I see. Nah, Abe, Abe is just having fun in the park right now. After that SD, things definitely changed. Yeah. He's just chilling. But I feel like to some degree, we are seeing a bit of unfamiliarity from Abe in terms of battling the lake. Definitely, I feel like and Clapper is doing a good job of adjusting his, his DI, his playstyle for these game watch combos, but Abe is just a good game watch. Yeah, oh, unfortunately, so, you can't go for that immediate down there. Abe was immediately ready. Oh, and this should be death. Tried to get that, but he... Is Abe going to close out the edge guard? Nice. Oh, man, look at that. Absolutely beautiful coverage. Yep, 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 and yep, the yep. back air to close out the game. Clapper going out. 0-2. Well, he put up a fight. He definitely did put up a fight. That first game went uh, a lot better than expected, yeah. and he SD'd in he the SD second game. Second. Yeah. So we definitely cannot overlook that. Overall, a really good performance. Run it back immediately. <laughs> Salty money match. Keep getting up in the <laughs> in the loser bracket and make your way back. Yeah. Throw down a dollar. But we like the performance that we got to see right there. Of course, it was expected to see Abe come out on top, but good performance from Clapper. Oh well, yeah. Oh, well, yo, nice. hope, hope everyone is doing well. Since we're quickly in the intermission, I want to go ahead and let y'all know is, uh, Kirk, can, can you get me here in, uh, in bracket, uh, or not bracket, but I just wanted to go ahead and type in Techni. They are the sponsor currently, and they are the chairs that we're sitting on. So if you could, like, go ahead and look at this. Let me, let me move this way. It's like orange, like lace quilted chair. It actually is quite nice and very comfortable now that I'm sitting in it. But now we are seeing Kali go up against Moon Chui. So that is a Sora versus a Lucas. 
And this is where things begin to get interesting, folks. This is what I know. Matchups that we typically don't get to see at home, or especially if you're playing online. This one was rough for me when I played the Sora, so I'm interested to see how Boon Choi does. All right. It's the uh, Lucas from Kali here. And just... for and for synchronicity, it looks like we have somewhere around 10 attendees in Street Fighter Six and Guilty Gear Strive are being played. So this was last week. If you guys want something to do on a Friday night, you can uh, out here join the FGC, play some Street Fighter 6, some Get to Gear Strive, and Tekken 7 is played even in friendlies if it's not bracket. From my understanding, the games are decided that night in terms of what they're going to go ahead and do in bracket. Everyone has a good time. And I'm looking at the. Oh, Jackter's actually playing. Yeah. Oh, interesting. And it looks like Sean Y got taken out by Funk, but then defeated Funk in Loser's Final to actually take it out. Wow. Nah, I'm, I'm definitely gonna have to come one of these days, check it out on a Friday night for Synchronicity. They are a number 33. Nice. It was mostly two and O's, one and threes until grand finals. Yeah. Two, three, and two. That's nice. Yeah, that, that would be exciting to see. Yeah, we we definitely got to see. Uh, what well, what's the meta here within the San Diego scene itself? Casey was in here. Oh really? But O and two. DQ on two. Neckleb didn't show up. Neckleb didn't show up for the Kin game. The That's game fine. where Kin is busted. <laughs> like what? <laughs> nice. Huh? Oh, it looks like Casey went up against Jactor actually in bracket. Jactor oh, yeah. took him no, out. No, no, talk about. No. <laughs> <laughs> talk about how I beat Neckleb. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was like. Neckleb DQ. <laughs> <laughs> Kin is great. I beat Neckleb. <laughs> who, who do you play that game? Zangief. Hell oh, Zang yeah. Zangief. Nice. How, how do they say or, uh, it? Zangief. Zangief. Yeah. Zangief. Yeah. <laughs> Zangief. Yeah. Damn, that's nice. Who did a... Uh... I don't use monitor controls, though. Oh. I was going to use monitor controls, and then people were like trying to teach me how to play the game, and all the buttons were different. So yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Classic, I feel like, just works better anyways. Like, you have more options. I mean, apparently... But, Modern but geek is like it's super a it's a, <laughs> it's a meme. It's a meme at, at, at this point. It's like the easiest way to get to master. Yeah. yeah. Oh well. No Ma all the way to master. Yeah. Well, I've I, I've seen some people. Well, they got fucking fundies. Like they know how to play like yeah. fighting games in general. But like the modern controls are just light heavy or light medium heavy and then special. So you don't even get to choose between punch and kick. Yeah. So it's like you're just. I like having more control. Yeah. yeah mm -hmm. Even if I'm a scrub, I like. Having yeah, yeah. It's yeah, I feel like it's been like for me. I haven't played Street Fighter at all until this game. So I'm just having one of the weird, inputs and yeah. shit. Um, yeah. The the like stick stuff is the hardest thing for me. The yeah. punch and the kicks I love. I mean, like, you I you got to do full full circle inputs. Yeah. yeah. Like like, yeah, like, yeah, like yeah. He, <laughs> he, doesn't he do double circle like inputs too? I think he has one or two. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like that's that's freaking that's crazy. Like on reaction. <laughs> but like think about like doing that movement yeah, and just, just trying to grab corner. someone. But Crazy. he also can just like mash all three buttons at the same time. And, just... and lariat, <laughs> yeah. Spinning lariat. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I, I, I was uh, I was telling Curb that I wanted to play Geef going into Street Fighter Six, and I just realized I'm not good enough at Street Fighter to play <laughs> Geef. Like I have to learn the basics first, so I'm, I'm going with Ken. Yeah, and they say he's hard or whatever, right? Oh, does it? The like little difficulty just like, I I can see it for sure. Yeah. Like. Kali, Station One. He's weird. Kali just shook it. He just <laughs> nodded and was like, "Okay, I'll stand here." I've been uh, I've been <laughs> sticking with Cammy in that game. Apparently, Cammy sucks, but she's like who I'd also want to play. Yeah, cool. I think she's pretty good. Yeah. She's I, she's good, but just hard to actually be good with. Is what I I feel like going yeah. So for Phil me, I want to just learn her as a base for the game. Unfortunately, so, Geef has consistently been ranked as the worst character in the game so far. And like really? all of the tier lists I've seen. He's huge. Yeah. Wow. So, yeah. DK made it hard. Yeah, like, <laughs> woo! Yeah. That's what I've seen is he just gets hit by so much shit. Yeah. So, yeah. It's rough for him. It's rough for him. For Kami, I can crouch under a lot of shit. Mm -hmm. So. It's great. So, when uh, Tekken 8 comes out, are you going to play King? You're gonna land all those all those wrestling moves. I wanted moves. to play King in Tekken 7, but even that's too hard. Yeah. You know, like it's like he's hard and it's a 3D fighting game, and, <laughs> yeah. I've, never, and I've never played Tekken before. And a lot to learn. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, like 3D spacing and then juggling. And, and then, you have to like do like multiple inputs per throw or yeah. something. Yeah. Oh like, yeah. It just explodes my mind. I can't do it. Yeah. Nah. I'm my my Tekken name is Lucky Chloe. So. Lucky. Oh yeah. Thank you. Hell yeah. 
I don't know if she's gonna be in Tekken 8. But... I think I would play of the characters I saw in Tekken 8 with the beta more recently too. Mm -hmm. I would definitely play Lily. Yeah, I can see you playing Lily. Okay. I do. Uh, have you seen a uh, Balrog <coughs> casing? Balrog? No, Walrong. Oh, oh, it's it's or? Is, is that how you say his name? I think it's Horang. Oh, Horang. I think I heard it. Was like, it was like Walrong. Oh, maybe. Oh, so, something like that. I think. I think. Every time I've heard someone talking about it, it's Horang. <laughs> I think. I think you're saying the American pronunciation. Oh. It's, it, it's like <laughs> Ryu versus Ryu. Yeah, 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 yeah. like that. <laughs> That's true. Well, freaking, you select him in Smash with a Ryu. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> True. But I still hear people be like, oh, Ryu. Ryu. And I'm like, I'm like, nah, dude. Is that how the older games said it? Yeah. No. No. I, even like don't know how to read. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, dude, it wasn't until Street Fighter VI. I always called him Zangief, but it's Zangief. Zangief. I don't yeah. think I'm ever going to call him Zangief, yeah. if I'm being honest. Yeah. I don't think he calls himself Zangief. Yeah. <laughs> so just for short, it's Gia. Yeah. Gia. Yeah. Like yeah, like the nickname I know him as is Geef. Yeah. Like we, yeah, it's just oh yeah, it's Geef. I'm a Geef player. Oh, I like suffering. I play Geef. <laughs> yeah, it really is like he's just DK again. Yeah, yeah. He's a grappler. That, that's why when you said that DK main at heart, I was like, I feel that. I feel that. We gotta stick to our garbage. Stick to your soul. <laughs> All right, we're starting off here on Small Battlefield. Small Battlefield. Troy with the Hideki. Oh man. Immediately trying to go for three back airs in a row. Uh, Bung Choi really tasted, uh, tasting, testing out the spacing from Kali. Oh! Oh, and uh, unfortunate Sora is Oh, uh, was this a button check? Oh, button check. Button check? Didn't they, they got hits though. Something happened. I'm seeing, I'm seeing the face of, I understood that this was a game and something happened here. Of, no, it wasn't a game. Yo, that Lucas outfit is actually really cool. That's not the outfit he had. When he was playing. But things are definitely spicing up here tonight, y'all. Winners round two. Oh yeah, I forgot to. No, I did. I did share, right? Hell yeah. All right, let's restart it. Kali versus Bunchui, and we even got an outfit change right here. We are gonna see Sora versus Lucas. Nah, not an outfit change at all. I'm tripping. That mod is just weird. You were able to land PK Freeze off bat. This is not a good sign for how <laughs> things are going to go. Because we know that when Kali is feeling himself, he throws out that move consistently. Oh, he did pick the wrong tag. Oh, I see. And so this... That move is absolutely ridiculous, dude. You play a broken character. <laughs> yeah. How the hell did that fit through the stage? Dude, when I play with people that aren't uh, like as good at Smash as we are, yeah. which is not saying much, uh, <laughs> I can already tell that Sora is a broken character. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you don't know what to do with this. Yeah, like, ah, okay, cool. <laughs> then let's have fun. Yeah. And by let's have fun, I mean I'm I mean, going to... I have fun. Yeah. <laughs> me, me have fun. <laughs> oh, all right. Nice little B reserve. Uh, oh, reverse okay. PK fire. This should still interrupt him right here. Yeah, but he's got wow, the and that still hit him through the stage. Absolutely ridiculous. I Sonic thought he had Blade the edge guard for sure. But yeah, Sonic Blade is a nutty move, that's for sure. Yeah. I know a lot of people like were knocking Bruce. on it, saying that it was like pretty predictable and you can hit people out of it. You just have to know how to use it. And what you use it. Most definitely. All right, are you able to nice. close out the edge guard? The Mortal Kombat theme is in the background. They are looking for blood right now. All right, one, just, just one jab into it. Let's see what you do. And all right, Bon Chui, with the up air closing out that stock, it is getting hectic here tonight. If Lucas had a fatality, what do you think it would be like? A fatality? Yeah. He would probably involve that snake somehow. Right? Oh, yeah. nice. Yeah. I feel like he'd close it around your neck and then, like, PK fire your skull off PK or something. Fire. Yeah, yeah. Actually, yeah, oh you're my right. God, huh? That would be the worst. Yeah, he like puts yeah. a PK freeze in his hand, puts it in their mouth, in, in their mouth, yeah, and then it explodes. Like once the once he walks away, looking all super cool. <laughs> uh, Casey, have you seen like the most recent trailers and all that of Mortal Kombat? I'm not gonna play it because I just don't like the way that feels. But Omni Man. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. It's gonna be great. I like just finished watching Invincible. Oh, oh man. Nice. That's yeah, now, now you understand the brutality that Omni-Man is, <laughs> is capable of. And in Mortal Kombat, that's going to be messed up. I can't wait to see Super Yeah, I feel like Homelander is going to play a lot, probably like Superman did in the Injustice games. But Omni-Man, he's like, he's a warrior. Like, yeah, he's like, he's, he's going to come in. So, so I want to see how, like, they... Have right? mm -mm. No, he's just super strength and speed and flying. And flight, yeah. 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 Yeah, and, and, and ruthlessness. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And cunning. No humanity. <laughs> yeah, at, at, at all. 
Yeah, I still remember the shock factor when I first started watching Invincible of just like how brutal it got in the first episode. Yeah, I was like, whoa. Yeah. All right, and Kali, Kali closing yeah, it out with ease right there, going up 1-0 against Bon Chui. Yo, that Mortal Kombat theme got me pumped up. Actually, that was a that was a good music choice. <laughs> when is the the second season of Invincible is coming out soon? No. Uh, yeah, from my understanding, they already uh, released the Adam Eve episode, so you can oh, go ahead yeah, and catch I up. I think that. it's like almost an hour long. Still need to catch up on that for sure. And now we are moving on to Battlefield. A lot more platforms. This is actually beneficial to both of the characters, but yeah, to my understanding, I think Sora uh, succeeds a little more here. Oh, they went back to the stage. Oh, maybe it's not a good pick for Sora. Oh, and now we go to Hollow Bastion. That's just, I don't know if that's good for Sora, but that's definitely a Sora pick. Yeah, I feel like that's a, that's a Kingdom Hearts pick. That's a Kingdom Hearts pick. That's not a Smash pick. Yeah, that's like, <laughs> I like this stage. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I pick that stage, yeah, yeah. you know? I'm not, I don't know what If they had Simple and Clean, though, come on, dude. Come on. You know, we would go. You have to we, buy a whole other game and play it for two seconds to get that song. We we would be going absolutely nutty if Simple and Clean and like the 19 remixes of it that exist. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now I know what I'm sending Casey. <laughs> yeah, so the Simple and Clean. Simple and Clean, Simple and Clean, Planet B remix, Simple and Clean, the other remix. <laughs> the other remix. That's what it's called, by the way. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> And oh man, all right. It looks like the Hollow Bastion pick didn't exactly work out for Boon Chewie still. Kali is not falling for any of these usual yeah, I traps. Was, I was going to say, I think I took Kali to the stage and it still wasn't good for me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is uh, this is where you learn. He is trying to close it out. Wow. Nice. Actually being able to get him, but but the DI looking absolutely clean from Boon Chewie right there. Hey, fair enough. You can go off stage way more than Lucas can. Absolutely. So you might as well apply that wow. Yeah, Curb, you're so right. Like, you especially got to wait for Lucas to go off stage, and that's where he's going to be the most vulnerable because Kali right now has better nooch on stage. Yeah, he's got better stage, better nooch. Papa John's. Papa John's. <laughs> better ingredients, better pizza. Papa John's. Oh, no. Way he landed the PK freeze. Oh, man. We're down at two stocks, folks. You know he's feeling himself. Look at that. Immediately going for the <laughs> spike off stage. My, that, uh, my dude is feeling he's cooking telegram too probably is not scared anymore if he ever was yeah or right. a down throw nice yeah, leading to a fair yep. Ooh, good old back air placement right there from boon chui probably is going for that telegram more now though. oh yeah oh man nice. the juggle i really thought he was about to continue that after going for the down tilt yep. oh nice fair usage trying to use the tether right there to interrupt oh man Trying to, try, trying to keep the movement ambiguous as to not get discovered. Yeah, I gotta say, I, I definitely respect uh, Uchoi's Sora movement here. Mm. Using the spells off stage and after running off. Yeah. Good shit. Good yeah, stuff. like actually, like really good placement. But you can tell Kali is applying pressure. Oh, yeah. Uchoi is playing in a, in a much more frantic pace that we haven't seen before. Like, he sped it up, like, at least by, like, 1.2 for sure. Which I can understand, but you gotta watch yourself with these spells out here. Yeah, I feel like, if, if anything, something that we've learned in all of our matches is you can't play Sora fast. No, no, no. You can, but you gotta, like, know when to stop. I, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There, 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 there comes a certain point where it's like, no, no, my friend. Like, no, you are going too fast. Yeah. And you messed up. But here we are down to the last sock so we're seeing a bit of adaptation but Kali's still trying to have his fun right there almost oh. landing the PK freeze he knew what he was gonna do he Woo. got you online he's got a read of your movement he knows uh, your habits what are you gonna do to retaliate Bun Chui? His, his, his defense is good he's keeping that shield out he is patient and if there's a, if there's something that Sora succeeds against is impatient people 100% he's got the punishes all oh, the man. in the world Dude, he wants to land this PK freeze so he bad, was. dude. You could, you could just tell. You could feel it in his bones. I feel like he's also doing that uh, stuff he does where he just throws out spells so that you get closer to him. Yeah, for sure. He is trying to bait him out to, to come in, and then Lucas yeah. performs his dragon punch. No, I'm just yeah, kidding. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> oh! Drive impact going. He actually got hit by Thundaga right there at that moment. Nice. It, that's like what I do against you all the time. Oh, wait, I was gonna say wait like one more second. Yeah. Just one more second. You're good. All, <laughs> all the trauma hit you at the moment. <laughs> oh man, nice. For I got to the dash attack. A really uh, good confirm to have. Still late though. Bro. No, oh, the, I thought that was gonna kill. The DI is good from Boon Chui, but are you gonna be able to get Wow Nice. Using his own thunder to avoid the thunder. Yeah, PK Thunder versus Thundaga. You have finally met your match. <laughs> Yeah, this Ooh. Is a good set. Yeah, nice. 
you know, we were, we were thinking maybe Hollow Bastion wasn't the right pick, but uh, it but seems like it's working out for Bunchuli right now. This is where all of his friends give him this power, dude. Oh, really? This is where this is where he lands the this spare bomb? That oh! The up air, oh my god. Catching your panic jump with the up air, that move being absolutely devastating. It is now 1-1, one, one, and folks, it is getting competitive. Did Boon Troy just say no bands? Damn, did, is, that, is that what you read? I heard Kali say, what are your bands, and Boon Troy shook his head. Damn. And oh. this, you should have banned this oh. stage. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> We know Kali it's loves nice Kalos. Ceiling. He loves Kalos. This is going to be rough for Sora, I think. All right. Game hey, number three, folks. Three. Winner's round two. Dang. It's, it's already heating up. Yeah, I, I really appreciate seeing the Sora gameplay, especially against uh, someone that I played with this yeah. character. Yeah, uh, Cur so. Curb actually played Kali in bracket, so like he understands what, what what it's like to actually play against him. But it's good to see the different options that Boon Choice throwing out, and it's good to see Kali has definitely grown for sure. Most definitely. Since then. Most definitely. So. We have seen a lot of growth from Kali in particular. He is uh, what what I would like to call the gatekeeper of Game Sync. For sure. Definitely. One of, one of a few. He's, he's hard to buzz. It's hard to buzz. Yeah, if you can get past Kali, then then maybe, maybe, maybe you can contend. You can play against Neck Love and get knocked off. <laughs> <laughs> you can play against AC and get 3 0 real quick. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Ooh, the very uh, final hits of uh, Blissaga hit right there. The dash attack into the neutral air for the crash. That was actually beautiful, dude. That was awesome. Ooh, oh, oh, nice oh, air dodge oh, from Kali. I think Lucas and Ness have like one of the best air dodges in the game. Oh, that's uh, most definitely, and especially a high percent, he's going to be able to get out oh, of that very sure. easy. There's, I don't think much uh, Sora can confirm at this point. No, you got to like hope for an up air. Yeah. For a spell or something. Like nice. There you go. He has landed a lot of those up airs, especially very low uh, when recovering, and Kali has not died. Oh. Look at the patience from Kali. Ka he loves Kalos, man. He's he's gonna stay out there all I mean, day. He can recover way more with the balls on this stage. Ooh, nice. perfect placement of the PK fire right there. Nice. And the thunder gonna Thundaga gonna end it off there. Finally taking the sock. The first time that we've actually seen Thundaga take one. Oh wow, both doing their fire moves. <laughs> it's funny. They both have thunder. They both have ice oh, and oh, fire. Right. What a matchup. Yeah, right. They actually have like the same spells, the same tools at their disposal. Two one, RPG main characters against each other. One is magic and one is psychic. <laughs> All right, he uh, wow, he completely decided to forego the down smash to cover him at ledge, and instead yeah. PK freezed him. That was ridiculous, Kali. You're playing insane right now. Oh my god. Because you could totally tell when Chui was waiting for that down smash again so he can hit him through stage and he's like, uh uh. -huh. No, no, no. You're getting frozen. No, my friend. You've been encased in ice. You're gone. Just actually playing some footsies there for a little bit. Uh oh. Play. Uh oh. Nice. Tech. Nice. We got, we got the mash. We were hitting up E consistently. <laughs> <laughs> there was no way I wasn't going to do it again. <laughs> he did take off the wall on the second thunder. Look, look how confidently Kali is playing off stage right now, man. Like, he is not afraid to drift out, to air dodge out. Oh, but the follow through nice. from Boon Choi. Let's go. Okay, down to last stock. Pretty, pretty low percents for Boon Choi, too. It couldn't be. Bring it back. He's trying to get the party started with that F till. Oh man, see, look, the Faraga to the dash attack. We know it to be a confirm, but he uh, believed a little too hard. Gotta mix it up a little bit. Throw in some footsie. <laughs> Throw in some footsie. You know. <laughs> Come on. Stop the fireball. <laughs> oh man, these PK fires have been landing so oh. much. Ooh, oh, damn. Dude, Bunchui was about to get hit by that PK freeze. What a nah, nice dude. Kali, Kali is feeling himself right now, dude. This is a stage, man. Yeah, even though it's down to last talk situation, it feels like Bunchui has been behind consistently, even in the game that he won. So he's really gonna have to steal this from Kali. Nice. Oh, nice fair. Oh man, he's about to PK fire a little too slow for uh, what? Would you call it dancing? Not dancing blade. What was it? Sonic blade. Sonic blade. There Sonic. you go. Yeah. Oh man, down tilt to the F tilt. Always gonna be a confirm. Decided nice. to fake him out with the Thundaga. It's consistently hit when he's like recovering, and Lucas is trying to hit him with something. Yeah, but when he uses it on stage, it like never. Yeah, lands. It, it, uh, it never does land. It seems like he doesn't really use it for positioning either, so it's just interesting to see. Yeah. 
Which oh I'm man, see me be using it. that was that was frantic. Yeah, because you definitely use it different. Yeah. Ooh, nice. Very good timing to get up, but Kali's feeling a little more confident. I think he's gonna let this up. He's gonna let these up airs rock right now, dude. Don't yeah. worry about. It. Oh, dude, he nearly healed 40%. Yeah. Nah, these up airs are gonna rock right now, dude. Watch out. Nah, he's keeping his distance. He doesn't care anymore. Oh, dude, nah, this. Yep. The Sora main here was clenched, and Kali took it two to one. Munchui being knocked down to losers, and Kali continuing in winner's side of bracket. Big props to Kali. Resident Luki showing uh, what it's made uh, consistently within, uh, I mean, the, the, the top eight here, undoubtedly, all of the time. How many uh, how many attendees we got today, Kerb? I actually uh, I actually didn't oh, check out I, I didn't check out that bracket today. Where's it show? Oh, see, like you would normally have to open it on oh, a, yeah, on a, it yeah, yeah on, on the desktop to actually see it. But what's up, everyone? Good to see y'all. We are sitting on some comfy Techni chairs, and if you guys haven't seen it, it's already in chat. Techni Sports. So go ahead, save on gaming chairs, desks, and accessories. So use that code GameSync for ten percent off at checkout. 26, 26. I believe Curb has already mentioned that he wanted to get the kawaii style chair, the one yeah, that specifically that. has the heart in it, because it's neon Genesis colors, 100%. 100%, and not because I love those colors. <laughs> I, 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 it would be either be that one or this mm. gray one. You know, for some, that cow one. For some reason, I could see myself with the cow one. Yeah, the cow one, I understand. Yeah, honestly. Moo like, mo now, pay later. Moo now, right. pay later. And let's one. see... <laughs> All right, so far we got AC advancing on 2-0. Dun Daniel 2-0. Ooh, I want to see me some Dun Daniel later on. He's been uh, playing phenomenal. All right, and let's uh, let's go ahead and click off the ad real quick. Bring us bring us to that four screen. So what's up, everyone? Uh, just as a quick reminder, my name is Namek, and sitting over here to my right is Curb. Uh, we are the, the local commentators. We have been on a bit of a hiatus, but we have returned. So good to see y'all. Good, good to be back. Good to be back. Good Ooh. to come back to some great games. Looks like MM Leo is in bracket. Definitely getting interesting out here. Skylander Dude 12, someone that we always see uh, here. We got Fire. We got the usual suspects. We got Abe, Kali, as you saw. Neck Love, of course. Ooh, Neck Love versus Don Daniel. Oh, that's not on stream. Damn. Oh, Neck Love is playing Steve. Hell yeah. Nice. Don Daniel is a Mario player and he is quite gifted, pretty talented at the game for sure. We're going to go ahead and check bracket right now so we can go ahead and update. Because this isn't Boon Chui or it's not Kali for sure. Um, let's see. Is it refreshed? Oh. No, it's uh, Shangri. We're Shanghai Viridian? and Viridian. So we got Shanghai and Viridian. Shanghai. Oh yeah, I was I was I was tabbing out of habit. And then uh, and then Viridian. And we are officially in winners quarter quarterfinal. Quarterfinal. And then we're still best of three. So what that means is the first player to two points is the one that's going to be moving on, taking on two matches. Uh, Shangrai, we've seen him play a variety of characters, but most often than not, it is the fox and the wolf. I know he's been leaning in a, a little harder into the fox, but we haven't been in here for the last month, so I don't know if things have changed. Yeah, who can say? Yeah. Oh, I think you're missing the end. And uh, Viridian, I do believe I've seen the name before. I'm not super familiar with uh, who they actually play. We see Shangri going right now with the wolf, so he's going with the secondary. And Shovel Knight. Huh? Shovel Knight. Huh? Look. Who is that? It's Travis Scott, dude. <laughs> <laughs> but. Oh, Young but Link? What oh, Young Link. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I was it's like... Young Link. Wow, I was so surprised. I was not expecting to see Shovel Knight. I just Knight. thought we were going to see a whole new move set. Oh, man, yeah. <laughs> I second. thought it was a completely new character. I was like, is this a me, me sword fighter that got completely customized? But That's no, awesome. okay. it, it is a Young Link. That'd be cool if, like, the bombs were the gears or something. Oh, the man. different, like, weapons they had. All right, we already playing some nooch. Who got the pundies, huh? I'm still like reeling from seeing Shovel Knight in this game. 
Yeah, we are both still recovering. We apologize. <laughs> I think just the fact that the mod covers Young Link. Wow, yeah, Shangri just, was so close to landing that back air. I'm just looking at show when I move in this game now. Yeah, look at him. He actually looks way cleaner as this character funny. model. Yeah, I, I like it a lot better than, than his actual design. All right, maybe using a bit of the confusion to his advantage right now. Uh, Viridian is keeping up the, the Link agenda strong. Boomerang to arrow to bomb to boomerang to arrow to bomb. <laughs> Where's the grab? You got to throw the hook shot. Oh, oh every now and then? I don't, I don't think. Nah, nah, that was, that was the clapper maneuver, bro. Clapper was the one that actually used the grabs. We'll no, have, we'll, but they're even better. We'll have to see if Viridian is the, the kind of grabber here. Interesting going for the Nair instead of the fair. Nice. Wow, exploding the bomb. Yeah, oh my god, that's set up on the ledge. All right, and Got using it. the forward air to take out the stock, but you're a very high damage, and this is Wolf. Okay, so uh, that would have killed for sure. Yeah, if that FTO landed, but we are kind of seeing the problem that happens to Wolf, where it's like past a certain uh, percentage range of like 80 to 100, the character will live forever. Get like somewhere close to like 160 uh, damage. And which to a character wolf, that seems kind of ridiculous. And oh man, he is surviving the barrage, jumping back and forth, actually made it, caught the bomb, but he is still not safe. Ooh, trying to go for a very aggressive uh, down air. Viridian is playing with some ferocity right now. He's, uh, he's getting caught in his own projectile yeah. loops. Uh, Shangri is definitely making him question it, throwing out the reflector. Woo! Nice. Oh, but it, it back. immediately made it back. The percentage was not high enough and did not hit the sweet spot. <laughs> Look at this. I the, like that run around bomb throw. <laughs> absolute patience from Shangri, just staying in shield at the corner, knowing he doesn't have to move, and using a B reverse uh, projectile to come back down. Super clean with it. But even as we're saying that, I mean, Viridian has the lead right now. Yeah, Viridian is doing a great job. Yeah. Playing this game at a, at a fast pace, which is honestly the way Shangri likes it. And this is one of the first times that uh, Kerb or I have seen Viridian. So yeah, we're just sure. kind of sitting back and enjoying the nice. play. That was a quick run up on the up air. Oh, yeah. The, yeah, there, there's just something about Young Link that he just moves so fast, man. We also have another uh, resident player. From my understanding, he's retired, but he goes by the name of Poison. Oh, yeah. He's a young Link main, and again in secondary. And I, res <laughs> I respect the hell out of that because I'm again in main. The two sides of man. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You're either a small boy with sword going. <laughs> yeah. Or, or a big man with sword. Yeah, going, yeah. Oh. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Oh man, beautiful punish, being able to land the back here immediately, but the uh, projectile, the boomerang, getting reversed. Wow. Ah, Shangri is getting caught right now. He's in the blender. When are you going to get out? Is this just data collection? Oh, man. Is it honestly it could be. Dude, he could immediately just bring out the Fox and just maul Viridian for yeah. the next game. That definitely should have been an edge guard right there. Uh, moving up uh, ever so slightly past the ledge. Wow. And as as we're saying this, Shangri is bringing it back. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, I mean, he's oh, man. It's 130 or 130. If he, if he can survive this. All right, he's already back. He looks like he's in the clear. Yeah, it looks oh man. Like, uh, Viridian is just kind of hanging out further back on stage. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Really good DI from Viridian right there to actually get out of that. Out with the that was honestly such a good call out from Shangri. If that up smash connected, that would have been death. And does Nair kill? Yeah, Nair kills. Wow. Nair actually killed right there. And Viridian going up one game against Shangri using a Shovel Knight. Don't be confused, it is Shovel Knight, completely new character. Damn. It's weird how they made him play like the same. Oh, for this we, have a, we have a young Link on stream, and, and people are like, never mind. Never young mind. I have, I have something better to do. It's Shovel Knight, guys. Dude. Oh, he's, he's changing the name. You know what that means. He's changing the name. Yes, sir. I'm in your head. I know what you're doing. It's 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 because of the Smash Stick. It's, uh, that's the only thing it changed. It's the Smash Stick, guys. But he picked the wolf color of Fox. They're playing Never Gonna Give Me Up. Yeah, Are they? By Rick Axley. Yeah. That's hilarious. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn, dude. Triggered by that song. Damn, modding fighting games is the greatest thing ever. I never realized. <laughs> Actually. Oh my gosh. That's why I got Street Fighter on the PC. Like all those Guilty Gear mods, like yeah. where you can play uh, Potemkin as like a maze dolphin. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's yeah. awesome. They, they, uh, they called it Patsugeki. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
All right, we're already seeing a bit of a difference here. Shangri, uh, ooh, getting very confident with that Phantom. Yeah, he was uh, he was getting out uh, outsped, outclassed uh, previously. But I appreciate how he's playing Fox with the Wolf color. Yeah, but he he is uh, holding in a little too much right now. And if there's something you don't want to do against the Lynx, just hold in. Yeah, don't the... don't don't do it. <laughs> and you got to keep it ambiguous because if you continue holding out, they know. They know. I have so much trauma. <laughs> <laughs> As a Link player once myself. Yeah, Link, yeah. Link is someone that like I can like appreciate, and I do yeah. like playing. But it's like at the core, it's projectile. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah. I mean, the Zelda games are all about the items that you get. Mm -hmm. So. I mean, dude, if anything, the most useful item that I ever saw you use was an arrow. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, in uh, in Breath of the Wild, hundred percent. Yeah. A thousand percent. In. Uh, Breath of the Wild 2? <laughs> it doesn't it doesn't have a different name. <laughs> but the other one's like the boomerang oh, is so man. good. Yo, hold up. Viridian's coverage though? Yeah. Like like in terms of what he's got going on at like ledge and when like they're recovering, it's just keeping it ambiguous. I really like it. Look at that, even canceling out the bomb that was getting reflected back. Looks like we're seeing a bit of adaptation from Viridian for sure. Throw the bomb up, the Ooh, and caught it back. <laughs> All right, Viridian is ready with it. Okay. Almost like Diddy Kong with the banana yeah. shenanigans. Yo, speaking of that, where's Cody at? <laughs> yeah. He's got school. Yeah, yeah. We, we need to see some Diddy Kong and bragging him. Oh, letting the up smash rip. Hey, Cody, you All right, and now he's gonna keep his distance. He's still playing the wolf color, and look at that, using a little bit of laser. Oh man, if there's something. I don't know what it is, but it's something about Fox's laser that just grinds my gears, man. Oh, really? Yeah, as soon as it lands on me, I'm just like, wow. Like, That's funny. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Damn. What? What happened? What happened? He just dodged off the stage. That was, oh, he air dodged? Like, he, he air dodged? I don't know why he didn't. I thought, I, he didn't, that was, that just looked like an SD. Yeah, who, Straight up. Who can say? Okay. All right. Well, I guess Anyways. we're here, folks. It is 1-1, and we are moving on to Battlefield. Seems like Shangri is going to continue using the Fox. It led up to some success right there. We don't know what happened on that last talk. I forgot what we were talking about. But let's see if a Viridian can make the adjustment. That was quite a shock, honestly. That was a weird... the Shovel Knight color. That was a weird ending to that game. I am no longer an edgelord. Now I'm holy. Yeah, now, now I become light. <laughs> Shiner on worlds. Shiner on worlds. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, look at that laser already landing six uh six percent. Oh yeah, that's when I get hit by Fox's laser, I'm just like a... Nah. That's, for, that's for, for, for me it's like a no, why? <laughs> that's funny. Because for me I feel like the other person is just like trying to get damage. So I'm yeah. like, what are you actually wanting to do here? You know? Yeah, it's like it's just a cover for in my you're, mind. You're least. just trying to get six uh six percent more so you can land up smash that'll yeah. actually kill me. Yeah, I'm like, so I'm, like, I'm not paying attention to the laser, yeah. I'm paying attention to what you're doing after oh. the laser. You're the fox player here. Yeah, never mind. No. <laughs> <laughs> that's why. That's why you don't care. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Also, when I use it, I'm just like, <laughs> yeah, you're like, ooh, laser, <laughs> laser go pew. <laughs> oh man, this is the war of the nares right now. Look at this. Why do so many characters in this game have that same nair? Right. It's like they just stick out their legs, yeah. and like it's the it's the knee that hits you. Yeah. Ooh, nice. nice. You know, I, uh, I recently heard while I, while I was watching uh, melee highlights of of Gommel, Yeah. Uh, the commentators were talking about how nice back air is like the biggest cliche of commentating, and I was just about to say it like well, right there. Yeah, and I was like, up. Oh. I mean, when it's true, it's true. You it's, know? It, it is very true. All right, Viridian's still making a somewhat of a play here, trying to use the ledge trapping shenanigans, but Shangri is making it back on the stage, uh, really using Fox's mobility. Uh, against Viridian, and it seems like Viridian can't catch up. How many up airs is that? That was four in a row. <laughs> oh man, you just yeah, got hit with the back air. Uh oh. You could definitely get uh, up smash right now, and your stock is gone. Oh, nice up smash. Yo, the way that he timed that, that's called the meaty. Like when you're actually playing like Street Fighter and stuff. Like when it lands like with the last like final hits. Oh, I got that. Yeah. Yeah, I know what you It's like, like you're able to layer it in a way where it actually puts them in more stun. Yeah. Sir. Oh, nah, dude. Nah, he just shined him out. Nah, we're playing oh. melee. Nah, Shangri, you're playing melee right now, bro. Right, you're, not, going, you're going crazy with it. Young Leak is here. We're back. Dude, Shangri got that Robert De Niro you talking to me face oh, on bro. right now, bro. Huh? Yeah, you like, eh? Huh? You win against me? 
<laughs> he's like, he's like, hold on, let me bring on my main. Let me bring on my main. It wasn't, it, it wasn't real. It wasn't real. My wolf is just my secondary. Yeah, it's, it's not real. It's not real. Fox wolf color is my real name. He's not using the drip wolf. The drip wolf. <laughs> yeah. I stole drip wolf for nothing. Oh, come on. Aww. Yeah, because he used, I think, just basic wolf. He used right? basic wolf the first time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just basic wolf. Yep. Nice. There's the up smash you were talking oh, about. Oh, wow. Meridian got the DI. Did actually not kill? I thought it fully killed right there. I believe. And oh, man. Look, the nah. Nice. Nah, look. Bro. <laughs> Bro, when you're just backflipping in front of your opponent and they're chilling in shield, that's a that, that that's a different. <laughs> that, that's how I'm trying to be. <laughs> Bro, he just reversed down smash to close it out. <laughs> Shagrai two one against Viridian, absolutely clean with it on that final game. Shangri uh, really a uh, uh, sweeping up shop right there, yeah, dude. For sure. That was a uh, a good thing. I told oh, you it was just man. data, man. Yeah, 100%. yeah. That that wolf match was entirely dead. Oh, I feel like my. I know he says they're training wolf, but I feel like that's what he uses wolf for. Dude, they're they're playing bangers, dude. The freaking modded smash is just playing trap yeah. music right now. This is freaking beautiful. What a beautiful thing. And oh man, it is hot, guys. It is summer in San Diego. We are sweating in our shirts right now, although it may not look like it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah the light from my head isn't any light. It's the heat. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It is, uh, the, it is a bald head, in case you're wondering, in case you can't see it, because he's, 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 he's fading into the, the ether. <laughs> it's just my soul is leaving right there. <laughs> but everyone, we are... Hey! And here we are in winner's semi-final, AC versus Shanghai. Uh, two of the top dogs uh, here at uh, Sink or Swim. All right, Game Sink in general. And I think um, this is officially when we move to the best of five territory, right? You got it. We're switching it up. And guys, we made it all the way to 176. Dude, growing up, uh, my parents had Dish Network. 176 was Cartoon Network. Oh, wow. That was the channel. It's prophetic. I think for me, the channels were like 30. Oh, man. Oh, you had like cable. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, had, you had real TV. Yeah. When I got older, for sure. Yeah. Before then, it was VHS, and that was it. Wow. I didn't even have TV. What were the what, what was like the go-to movies? Because like for us, oh. we had like RV, we had Monsters Inc. For me, I watched Lion King and Aladdin like all the time, for sure. My sister would watch Beauty and the Beast, Goofy movie. You're talking about like old Don't VHSs you guys would watch all the time? Yeah, because yeah. I told him what uh, you got? I didn't have like TV. I just grew up with VHS, so go-to VHS. Oh. My two were Terminator 2 Judgment Day. Hell yeah. And the Yellow Submarine. <laughs> okay. Wow. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> That's those like 100 times each time. Nice. Right. Yeah. It's crazy how much you can just watch movies over and over again. When it's all you When you're younger, yeah. <laughs> Dude, the, the Terminator in Terminator 2 scared the hell out of me as a kid. Like, he was terrifying. Yeah, actually. I, for, I forget his name. It's probably just T2 or something like that. But, like, freaking... T1000? Oh, T1000? Yeah, there you go. I don't know if he has, like, a name name, though. Oh, wait, is this Drip Fox? Wait, hold on, I just noticed. Is this is this, super, is this Supreme Fox? Oh, is it? Or, That's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> he's got he's got the Goku fit on. I thought dude. it was the stripes. Just wait until he parries something. Oh wait. He's gonna be fishing for the parries now. I forgot AC was playing Joker too. Yeah, he was playing Joker for like the last few weeks that we were here. We were gone a month and we're back, still playing it. I mean, yes. he pilots a lot of characters to a very high degree. For sure. Like we've seen him bust out the Falco, the Meta Knight. Of course, his tried is true. The main Snake. Uh, but I mean, no, we've seen him play way more characters. Falcon. Yeah, um, plays Falcon for the Dittos. Yeah. And I think we've seen, I've, we've seen him play like one or two other characters. I'm just, wow, very confident in going for that edge guard. Super deep right there. Nice, but that uh, move that he threw out. <laughs> <laughs> it's like after I told you the curse of nice back here. <laughs> Yo, but things are definitely heating up. We have made it here to winner's semifinals. This is already going to be a bloodbath because both of these players are well acquainted with one another. And this is Drip Fox, dude. What can you do against Drip Fox? Except stand... Yeah, dude, you're just standing in awe as, yeah. as, you, as you're just getting absolutely dripped on. Drip Fox is my name. Gasly never going to be up there. <laughs> yeah, That's, actually. Yeah, it's, it's beautiful. That's my worst nightmare. <laughs> 
Oh, dude, what happened? Like, oh, I got 2 0 would by Drip Fox and Bracket. I got Drip Fox. As Rick Astley. And yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I'm fine. I'm fine. Yeah, yeah. Just give me like two weeks. <laughs> give me two weeks and a few therapy sessions. And I think I can come back. Oh man, trying to use gun right there for the edge guard, but Shangri immediately turning that situation around. Ooh, a nice snare right there. Okay, nice. I didn't. I wasn't sure he would make it back, but Fox's. Uh, dude, that crazy. Robert De Niro face is increasing in intensity yeah, right now. Yeah, dude, right now he's he's interrogating someone tied to a chair right now. <laughs> Look at that. Drip Fox. Oh my god, dude. Oh. The intensity of the face, it's like, dude, if you were getting tortured by Robert De Niro while Rick Astley was playing in the background, that would mess me up. I, I, I'm sure that's a dream for some people, but for me, it is for not. For me, yeah. it's my worst nightmare. <laughs> Just Rick Astley in the background. Like, singing live. Oh, man, he actually, like, came back. He's like, oh, you guys hired me is for this? Dead? No, I don't think oh. so. Came back just to visit. I feel. I feel like if if Rick Roll died, we would know. It, 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 it would. Know. It would be like Harambe 2.0. Like, I'm gonna like start if, sending links to people and be like, "Yo, Rick Astley died." <laughs> Wait, you know that's how that's how people. I, know. Okay, I was like, I was like, that's one of the original Rick Rolls right there. <laughs> but if it's been gone for so long, I think people will like fall for him again. You know. Hold up, that was a beautiful get up attack from AC, dude. Like he just, honestly, his timing and his spacing is is quite impeccable. I know he is behind, but he could definitely. <laughs> Let me shut up. Let me shut up. Let me shut up. Let me shut the hell up right now. Damn. He is behind. Damn. Oh, wait. By any means necessary? That's what the jacket says? Hell yeah, dude. Supreme shirt. I bet you, I bet you his visor is Gucci. Like, like whatever his, his, his scanner is. His power scanner. <laughs> yeah. What is that thing called? I, I know the dragon. This looks like a DVD DC scouter. Yeah, yeah. Like. Scouter, yeah. So, are, are they, do they really like quick? What's his power level? <laughs> you know, like, Fox, <laughs> Star Fox. Uh, you hold up. You, you told me last time that Fox has metal legs. Is that yeah. true? Yeah. He yeah, does. They all do. Damn. It's part of the lore, man. Damn, bro. I actually played Star Fox and never and noticed I that. <laughs> <laughs> and I played the the I think they had one, one of the games on GameCube where Crystal got introduced. I played that yeah, one, Star, Star Fox, Fox Adventures. Adventures, yeah. Yeah. And I even I never noticed. I just assumed they were normal legs. Yeah, my man. They're like genetically yeah, they modified. Like yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, seriously. That's what it's for. Yeah. Because then the blood can't go to their legs if they don't have legs. That's the lore. That's the lore. Wow, I didn't know the lore. Yeah. I never Damn. played the games, but I did watch a Did You Know gaming video. Damn. <laughs> you, you, you just gotta talk to well versed furries and they'll educate you. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> <laughs> what are you trying to say? I'm not going to Mario Man oh. or anything. Yeah. But hold up, I'm gonna go use the restroom. Oh, for sure. And then uh, the Zoa is right there. Oh, nice. All right. Keeping it pretty even now. So, uh. Alright, just kind of throwing out moves there on the platform. Not sure what's going on there, but we are back to neutral. It's really interesting to see these, these players, uh. At this point, AC learning a new character, Shanghai sticking with the Fox. Both pretty good in their own right, but. Gotta see if Fox Main is just gonna win out here over the newer character for AC. Who who can say? Nice for there to finish on that landing. Okay, good. Oh, nice, but it's the ledge with no tech. Oh my god. Same thing, got that Robert De Niro going on again. We're just hopping around here, sticking around, seeing what he wants to do. Donnie, oh. Joseph, take your Okay, yeah, 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 for sure. Side beat to the to the left for some reason. Not sure what that was, maybe an in, a miss input, but AC for sure gonna capitalize off of that. Nice hanging out till the rebels guard is over. Yeesh. Already got him up to 95. Um, yeah, that's an up smash territory for sure. Game two going to Shanghai, going into game three. 
Let's see if a AC is gonna stick with that Joker. Um, he needs this. Thing. That's funny. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> so Shanghai 2-0 on AC. He's sticking with the Joker for sure. Let's see if he can get this game three and uh, pull it back, or if he's just gonna go down to losers here and make a run down there. He would go to. Where would he go to? Oh, losers' quarters. Okay. Nice, right, just sticking out, playing around each other, going around. Hanging out. Who wants to make the first commitment? We got some fellas in Paris. Wait, did they pick that song or did they come up on that? No, I think it's on the other one. I don't know if it's on stream. I, <laughs> I think it's from Station 2. Oh, nice! That's actually sick as hell. That's Kurt merch right there. I wish that would Oh, dang, Shangri is up 2 0. Oh, yeah, man. He, he, uh, took, he took another game while I was gone? Damn. Yeah, he, on the last stock, they were pretty even, but he got he got uh, AC up to like 95 and a couple of hits, or like a couple of strings, you know? Yeah. And then just like, some Ooh. Got him. Got him out of there. I'm trying to see if they're playing that Fellas of Paris song on stream. Oh, I see. Wow. Nah, Shanghai is getting absolutely. Ooh, in the up smash to call out the lazy recovery from AC. You're not going to be able to drift on a stage like that, my friend. Nah, dude, some. Like, the, the, the way that I'm seeing Shanghai play Fox right now is nearly like melee. Like, this is insane. Oh, yeah. He's gotten back to his roots, man. Yeah. He's, uh, he's actually using those shine stalls off stage, but uh, AC being well aware of those and being able to close out that stock. Oh, nice. Was able to use Rebel's Guard to bring out Arsene, but is Arsene going to be able to make much of a difference? Because right now, AC's, uh, I mean, Shangri is running away with it. Yeah, he's just kind of pushed him as far as he can. Oh, man, he's, he is trying to get that Firefox punish. If that is able to hit from the beginning, that is, that yeah. is like 30% guaranteed. It is devastating. Quite a disrespectful move to land, if I'm being honest. If you can land, if you can land the beginning of it, you can land that in bracket on someone like dude. Sheesh. Oh man, being able to use the phantom to the fair drag down. All right, but the fair drag down. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Nah, dude, he's he, he's abusing this. Look at him, bro. He's 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 in, in the interrogation room right now. <laughs> We're watching Goodfellas, and uh, and little Tony doesn't want to talk. I need to watch that movie for real. <laughs> it's also another Oppenheimer. It's, oh yeah. It's like it's like close to three hours long, I think. Why <sighs> people make all these long movies? That's Martin Scorsese, bro. He just he just makes long movies. The Irishman was actually like three hours and some change. Yeah, right. I thought yeah. it was close to four. Oh dang, probably. But it's like someone's like whole life. Yeah. Oh nah, man. The option select right now, dude. He has got AC's number. Yeah, this uh, Joker game plan has been found out. Oh dude, Definitely look at that. The perfect amount of space and actually avoid that projectile. Yeah. Shanghai's very much in the know right now. Yeehaw, projectile. <laughs> nah, bro. He's 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 playing this fox near perfect right now. Looking like Paris from the ribs. <laughs> only real ones know. Only real ones know. <laughs> oh! Nice smash to return the favor from last game. So far, it's only uh, times that Shangri has used that shine stall that AC can actually capitalize on the stock. Yeah, Besides that, AC hasn't been able to find much outside of that. Look at this. He's got him up at 90. Yeah, dude. He's uh, looking for it for sure. Oh, yeah, dude. He's, he, he's going to land one there and go for up smash. Oh, oh. <laughs> there it was. <laughs> Wow, he actually hit him with the Firefox. Wow! Don't touch that shield when you're at kill percent. And Shangri with a 3-0 over AC, moving nice. on to winner's final. But don't worry, folks. If uh, AC is your favorite player, he's still He'll got the loser side of bracket. Yeah, he's just going to go down and hang out yeah. in uh, loser's quarters yeah, for a we'll, bit we'll, we'll, we're done there. We'll see. He'll perform the loser's run of a lifetime comeback from losers. Dude, look at the... Look at the scouter. It's spelling it Supreme. out. Supreme. <laughs> <Is> it <good? laughs>
<laughs> Bro, he's Drip. That's Ow, funny. look at Drip Fox. Damn. Speaking of Drip, we got Tekken. Hell yeah, let's let's go ahead and type it in real quick, guys. Exclamation point, Techni. Curb, take it away. What we got here? We got these uh, gaming chairs, gaming style. Some of the, uh, I feel like one of the most comfortable gaming chairs I've sat in. Yeah. I've actually had a chance. Yeah, like I've, I've actually had a good amount out. of time. Oh, Pretty, I never oh. noticed how much they lean back. Yeah, you opened it up for me. Whoa. Wow. There you go. And it feels sturdy too. Yeah. It's a. Good. This a Bunch of different styles. We got the Cal, the Pink Neon Genesis Classic Gamer. Yeah, the Geo Series, <laughs> the Kawaii style. However you want it, they got your aesthetic. And if you use code GameSync at checkout, you'll get 10% off. And they are a, a proud sponsor that we have here at GameSync. That's pretty great. We just got these, or we just got the feel of these chairs for the first time. Oh, that's definitely Abe that is already nice. sitting down. So let's go ahead and update that. Oh, wait, capitalize. Abe, and then who is Abe going to be going up against? Is it the other side of Winter Summer? And Neck Love. Ooh, we got a banger on our hands. We got a banger on our hands, folks. I think we're going to see Game & Watch versus... I mean, we've seen Neck Love bust up a few different characters. He's playing Steve he, more recently. He's got a Steve. He's got a Mega Man. He's got a Doc. And most importantly, he got a Ken. Oh, and a Reed. Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah. you can't have a kid without yeah, me. Yeah, that's actually very true. All right, folks. You know both the characters might as well. Definitely buckle in, strap in. It's about to get, uh, I don't know, based on your opinion, maybe a little lame, maybe a little intense. That's kind of depending on uh, on how both of these players are going to approach it. I feel like Game Watch and Kid is uh, a rough matchup for Game & Watch. Mm -hmm. Because he hit hard. He hit hard. And Game & Watch light is a heck of yeah, I feel like Game & Watch can't be in S.H.I.E.L.D. No. around Ken. Like, yeah, like, like, S.H.I.E.L.D. is not an option. Yeah, your S.H.I.E.L.D. is gone. <laughs> but we'll have to see. I mean, Abe pilots this character to a very high degree. Yeah. Uh, uh, Neck Love has consistently dominated Bracket uh, here at Sink or Swim. He's uh, he's no stranger to taking first place, second place. So, we'll, we'll have to see. Both players going up against each other. If only I could pull up the set count right now and see what's going on between the two of them. I actually don't. I really don't know how to pull that up, if I'm being honest. I never. I never. See. Yeah. Like, do you just, like, click on it? Like, yeah. Oh, man, I'm smelling something fragrant in the air. Someone brought him some food. Someone brought him some. Oh. Is that a microwave? Yeah, that was a microwave, of course. It all corresponds. There is no such thing oh. as a coincidence. Oh wow! So actually, Sink or Swim number one seventy four. Abe got second at that one. Sink up Saturdays, he got first. Sink or Swim one seventy three, he got fifth. Oh, oh! But then he also beat Neck Love on Saturday three zero. So they might be a little contentious in terms of what their record is against one another. Yeah, I don't know how to pull up their second. All right, Bash needs a minute, and by Bash we mean Neck. Yeah, what's that picture that he has? I don't know if we can see that too much, but hell yeah, I'm excited to be here with y'all tonight. Yo, is he into like old school creatures? Yeah, that's like like creature, type stuff. yeah, creature of like the Blue Lagoon. Is this the dude that you sit down with and he'll explain to you every Godzilla movie that's existed? <laughs> but that's Godzilla. And like how Loctus Monster is actually related to Godzilla somehow? Whoa, well, I'd believe it. <laughs> I mean, I'd believe it. Honestly. I'm, I'm making this up right now and I'd believe it. <laughs> <laughs> You're telling me this right now and I believe it too. So. Alright, so from uh, what Kerr pulled up here is uh, if you scroll down a little further, they had a game five set at Sink or Swim 174 where uh, Abe actually took it over Neck Love. But Sink Up Saturdays, uh, he went up against Neck Love and took it 3 0. Yeah. Oh, dang. And then Chase, it looks like Chase actually came to Sink or Swim number 173, maybe uh, grinding up the chops. Oh, yeah. All right, folks. We are back, and let's go ahead and focus on stream. Of course, the Game & Watch. I appreciate the the fact that it's green Game & Watch. We're not going with, like... Because both, uh, I think Mia and Meister both use the same color. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the like, 
or a light blue one or something. Mm -hmm. Is it? Is that a light blue? It's like a. It's like a teal or a turquoise. Yeah, it's almost like electric, kind of like in its color. Electric. Electric. Well, but I'm sure electric blue is probably a different shade. I think electric blue is like. A, He's looking for examples around, but Shangri has made it on uh, to winner's final, and uh, between the two of these, the victor will move on to go against Shangri. So, of course, starting out on GS2, the try, the true, the classic. We love this stage. We know it. We love it. Going for the pin, going straight for that double short. You that confirmed. Two hits did 39. Yeah. That's Ganon damage. <laughs> that's Ganon damage, dude. Absolutely. And that's woof. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually giving Kerr PTSD now because in Street Fighter Six, I'm picking up Ken. I thought I was going to be a Geef main, but then I figured out how hard it is to actually play him. So you should play him. <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like with me, it's like even in Smash, because there's like a decent level of understanding, I can play heavies. Yeah. You know? Yeah. If, I didn't, if I didn't understand the game, I don't think I'd play heavies. Because heavies, you need to know what everyone else is going to be doing. You gotta be patient. Yeah. Like it's like it's, it's like the one true true sign of playing the heavy, and then most importantly, the cheese, the gib, the queso. Wow, actually taking out the the, the bomb just uh, with a with a good old kick. Do you think Ken's gonna use a kick or a kick? <laughs> Which one? Well, it's time. I feel like uh, Ken kick. It's the best option. Refreshing. It's... Uh, oh. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, Every nah. He was able to uh, use the focus. Dude, I... Wow, I didn't even did notice. You, did you... Nah. Yeah. <laughs> Does the can go crazy? What does it say? Oh. Mm. Well, first of all, it's that was uh, That was a slur from commercial. It says, healthy warrior. <laughs> My fellow everyday warrior. <laughs> Zoa is about healthy, positive energy that helps us all focus, be productive, and get stronger together. No way. Mana. Gratitude. Zoa. By Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Oh my God! This is Dwayne the Rock Johnson's energy is that drink. His signature. I guess so. That's a very nice signature. Yeah, right. Oh, it's he's good. he's using the chef. Is Abe gonna be able to make this comeback? I mean, I don't I don't count him out of it. But last time I said that, Shangri absolutely uh, demolished <laughs> my statement. So I'm I'm trying to be a little. Whoa, 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 whoa. We almost saw it. Curb's life flashed before his eyes, dude. Yeah, that shield break is the worst. Especially as game watch, like a 40 year day. Yeah, you're done. Ooh! Nice. Get him out of here. Yeah, wow, sure. and he still made it back. The recovery from Ken is ridiculous, dude. Oh, good nice. DI from, from Abe to actually make it out of there, but one more short you can and you're dead. For sure. There's, there's no way you survive. Can Abe keep up the pressure? Will you become the mauler? The Bro. helicopter of destruction? <laughs> Hold up, bro. That was clean. He ran all the way to ledge and then just rolled back to completely avoid that fair bomb. That was yeah. that was crazy, bro. I feel like there's just certain things that you do against your opponent where you're just like, yeah, I don't, I don't give a damn. <laughs> I don't care. Okay. Oh, I know what I want. That was the sourest hit of sure you can landing because if that was the sweet one, it would have been over for sure. Yeah, and, and he wasn't look, doing the flaming one either. And look, just like as I was saying, Abe definitely brought this back. I mean, look at that, Neck Love only wants one thing, and you can clearly tell. <laughs> Don't jump. <laughs> no, that's yep. what it's there for. That's, that's how Kali uh, got a game taken off of him. He was panning <laughs> jumping, and he was uh, called out for it, and that's exactly uh, what uh, Neck Love called out A for right now. Don't be jumping around me. I got a fire fist. The, the dragon punch, that the, the shore you can... Dude, can, can you imagine generating enough power in an uppercut punch that you actually like fly Lift in the a air? Whole body length up. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and like it's not like they like squat down intensely. No, they just. Yeah, yeah, they like it's it's just like a their quick punch pivot. Is so strong, their arm picks them up off yeah. the ground. That that is the punch that gave Sagat the scar on his chest. Well, yeah. Did you watch any more of that? That more video? No, no, not yet. I I like for I have to be at capacity because oh, it's I, like it's so much <laughs> knowledge to absorb, you yeah. know. Watch like ten minutes before bed I, every night. I actually learned about that family. They're they're, they're Argentinian though. What, uh, what Hugo comes yeah. from, and he's like one of the, the the youngest members, but the most successful fighting wise. It's Hugo Hagar. No, uh, Hugo Andorra. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, ha ha Hagar is a is another like like fighting game character. Yeah. He um most recently appeared in uh, MVC three. Nice. Mm -hmm. 
All I know is they have a statue of him in Street Fighter 6. Yup. Yeah, they have to pay tribute because he was in the Final Fight games. Yeah. And also, what is it, like Saturday Brawlers or something like that? I don't know the name too well. But even speaking of this, Abe is back uh, and hungrier than ever right now. He really wants to take it out. Yeah, he's speeding things up. Off. Yeah, look at that. It seems like he's finding a lot of success just sticking close to ledge. Don't go in the center stage because that's where... No Ooh. 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 Nah, bro. He's he's yeah. done that multiple times now. He's like, hey, if I go close to the ledge, Nekla wants to rush me. So, so I hammer. So I use hammer. <laughs> hammer. <laughs> look. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> that was perfect timing. <laughs> <laughs> if anyone's uh, played Mario and Luigi, the handheld games, oh, man, you, you guys know, you guys understand. Thunder. Thunder. <laughs> oh man, nice. that glove with the confirm right there, but still, you are Ken with one stock, and Game Watch has two. I don't know if Ashoto plays the War of Attrition really well, if I'm being honest with you. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> nah, bro, get your focus out of here. I'm down smash. I got two hammers for that. You. Whoa. Whoa. We got we got some real rage going on over there at the corner. Something Something gotta get managed. Oh hold up. We're missing the cinema player, the one with the hoodie. Who's the one? We have another player? Wow dude, Abe quickly took that game. Yo, someone was raging off in the corner, so we apologize if we weren't paying attention there. Nice, Abe won. Oh yeah. He's got the big drink. He's got the big drink. Remember what I was telling you? Probably. He's got the drink. Yeah, yeah. And it's funny because I, I told him that. And he's like, no. Like, he must be thinking of it. And I was like, you liar. That's <laughs> a big goal. Yeah. It's not a big goal. It looks like a Panera thing or something. But It's a big goal. It's still the thing. It's all from 7-Eleven. It's so simple. It's the same cup. They just put different words on it. You're right. You're right. And now, here we are. Hollow Bastion. And already, you can tell the difference. Neglove is trying to play the footsies. Dude, I'm sure you can do 21% damage, dude. Shield poking. Ridiculous. I don't know if that was the Sora player that raged, but it's, that's who was playing here against the Sora. I can see that. Yeah. But also, your, your character is yeah, absolute utter <laughs> BS, bro. If you get cheese, yeah. it's just part of the game. If if you play a top tier and you complain about getting beat by a low tier, that's yeah. called the skill diff. <laughs> yeah, like yeah. you should know how to play. Guys, I got I got my ass obliterated by a Bowser Jr. main. <laughs> um, do you remember his name? I'm, was, uh, I'm forgetting his name right now, dude. I apologize. No, no, it wasn't Jacker. Jacker was the PT. Um, Nomex. Nomex. Dude, Nomex, talented player. Wherever you're at, bro, I hope you're listening. Please come back to Bracket. Actually, you play this game beautifully. Yeah, he demolished me, and then he went to his Mario, and then I was like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fair I enough. I was like, GG's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes sense, makes sense. Yeah. And oh man, being able to land that short, you can scoop him from below, and that's something that they really took from Street Fighter, which I honestly appreciate, because uh, that... He that, actually, like, drags it on the ground. And and he actually has variations that could actually go, like, even deeper. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. nice. Like, like his supers, they can yeah. actually go, like, pretty far, too. Nice. So it's, uh, it's, if you're very good with the timing, it's a pretty broken, like, interruption move. Mm. Look at that, using um, using the jumps to get out of the down smash. I think Necklove is realizing that Abe has been uh, getting away with too many of these down smashes getting grounded. <laughs> Actually, yeah. yeah, dude, I mean, if you get grounded, I mean, what is it, like Banjo uh, down throw, Rob down throw? Um, there's there's a few. down throw. Yeah, like there, there, there's a few, and down throw. Yeah, there's a few move, uh, characters in this game that have grounding moves, and they're quite broken. DK. But uh, Game & Watch has no, no reason to have a grounding move at all, dude. He has good reason. Yo, that is so loud. Why can't I hear that in the highest detail pop? They got a, they got a speaker over here. <laughs> oh, I see. Okay, thank you. Thank you for adjusting that. I got absolutely obliterated by the noise. The menu music. No, hold up. We're talking about shield pressure. Yeah. Uh, neck love shield's looking a little... <laughs> this is gonna kill me if they're gonna vary the volume on that speaker. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like me when someone's talking to me and I'm trying to get back to the game and I'm like, oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. No, no, what? Oh, what? Oh, okay, no, no, no yeah. <laughs> oh, he actually caught the Hadouken. Nice. He was ready for a second one. I'm trying to be ever so delicate with the spacing. Nice. Look, look at Neck Love just slowing things down, being like, hey, I play a Fussy's character. 
And I'm gonna play Fussies. <laughs> True? Yeah, you should. Yeah, look at that. Ooh! Oh, nice. the, the back air bandit. The back air bandit is, is back. That's this color. Yeah. Freaking. Oh! Oh, look at that! <laughs> Bro, that's me playing Street Fighter. I was gonna say, we're out here playing Street Fighter. <laughs> yeah, we're playing... Uh, that's the medium pick you're talking about? Yeah, exactly. Actually... Yeah. Oh, yeah, I know what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that, that was exactly the move, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because his light kick is like this. Yeah, he, like, so slightly lifts it, but his medium actually, like, is... Horizontal. Yeah. Yeah. Precisely. Uh-oh! Nice. The chef into F smash. Dude, you can get hit by chef, because they can immediately come up with the F smash or the F tilt. They got you. They got you in checkmate pretty much at the corner. But down tilt might hit there too. Oh man, that's what they Game and Watch is ridiculous, man. <laughs> ridiculous. True. I mean of course I'm not I'm not gonna deny the, the kill power that Ken has as a Shoto. Probably one of the yeah. best Shotos in the game. I mean, is, is, is Terry considered a Shoto? I don't think so. Because I would Because if so, I would consider him the best Shoto. But if not, yeah. then I I give it to Ken hundred percent. What what classifies a Shoto? You know, Twitter got in a whole discussion over that, and I realized I knew nothing about what an actual <laughs> Shoto is because I think, I think with like the reasoning that people had for most like modern day Shotos, technically Luigi classifies as a Shoto. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, he has a short. <laughs> yeah. Mario, Doctor Mario. Yeah. But yeah, I think I, I think a Shoto to some degree has like a move that can pass through fireballs, fireballs, and the then the DP. How do you spell Shoto? Uh, S H O T O. A uh, shot hole. Bro, Abe is filthy. You are disgusting. Sir, you need to be put away. Go to the sanitation department. You need to be picked up, dude. Fucking Thursday mornings. That was ridiculous. Bro, Abe's going dummy right now. Look at this. Oh my god. He has consistently been landing that down smash to just ground Necklove, who is getting impatient. You cannot lose your cool against this character, man. You get tested, you get taxed. Game & Watch is the IRS, <laughs> honestly. Look at how he disguises oh, himself. Dude. Bro, he's mixing in that down smash at inappropriate times. This man is disrespectful. Oh, man, he did not want to get that shield broken. Rather took the punish. Oh, wow. It says it's a fighting game character stereotype used to define a character with special moves that mirror Ryu's Hadouken, Shoryuken, and Tatsumaki Senkukai. Yeah, so it's Ryu. So, so it's Ryu and Ken. Any character that has Ryu-like moves is yeah. a show. Uh, Akuma, Dan, yeah. Yeah, Sean, that's what it Sakura. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Uh, I can see it for Luke, sure. Maybe? He has the same kind of stuff. Yeah, you're right. Well, yeah, if, they, if they're going to make a new protagonist, it's going to be a showdown. Yeah. But Luke is just broken. Actually. His projectiles are crazy. Yo, someone's playing on another set right now, and they, for some reason, brought a surround sound speaker set. And it is louder than anything else in here yeah. right now, so we apologize if you can hear it into the speaker. Bro, Abe, Abe is going dummy. Like, I, I don't know what else I can say right now, except... He's at 140 and yeah, still living. Bro, he's running away with it, because, like, it, it's at this point, it's like, do you, do you give in? You know? Like, like... Do you, you, you might as well be giving in if you're getting hit with that down smash consistently like that. Oh, no. Oh, no, bro. Dude, the up airs. Oh, no. Look at his spacing, man. Oh, my God. The absolute coverage. You are getting murdered out there. Woo! That was an nice, air? Nice. Uh, was an air back air? Or maybe, no, that was fair. Nah, that was not back air. Yeah, yeah, I think I think maybe that was fair right there. Very clean usage, but I don't know if you're going to be able to make the comeback, dude. Abe has got the coverage with the up airs. Absolutely beautiful. It was an air. Thanks, thanks, Mercs. Yo, Mercs, we appreciate it. And that's uh, game four to Abe. Went in 3-1. Nice. That was Abe, crazy. Abe looking he ran away pretty dominant sure. in that last game. They were keeping it competitive and semi-close in the second and third games, but nah. Abe was like, I got, hold up, Nick. Like, I, I got your number, Bash. Don't you worry about that. But, all right, guys. Let's go ahead and go over to today's sponsor, and that is Technique. We have a nice little infographic that we can show you real quick. And uh, feel free to use the code uh, GAMESYNC to get 10% off. This is uh, Technique. Make sure to throw this in. Game in style. They got so many different series. The Geo series, the Cow series, the Kawaii style. So whatever you got, they got your kind of flavor. And it's actually the chairs that we are using ourselves right now. Yes, sir. They are great. 
comfortable, got that back support. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's it was, actually it was really good. that's actually something that I've consistently struggled with uh, with uh, commentating is like keeping that good posture. Yeah. And sometimes having a having a good chair reminds you to have that good posture for sure. For sure. And uh, and I think we're gonna be seeing Shanghai Eight next. Cool. Winners finals. Finally, AC and Necklove have been locked out before winners finals. Wow. That's the first time I've seen. That. Seriously. Uh, so let's go ahead and move it's gonna over. Be pretty exciting. Gonna kind of see what else we can see through here. Damn nice. We got. So we got Viridia. Ooh, Viridia took out MM Lamb. And oh, is nice. now going up against Pyro. And then McRat. Oh, dude. McRat was, yeah. was the first person I ever played in bracket. Yeah. Yeah. He is a He's rock. running through it, man. Oh, man. Let's go. He is a raw player, and he's pretty freaking good, man. So he's going to be going up against Kali, and whoever wins between McRat and Kali will be moving on to fight AC and losers. Oh, this is not Abe and Shanghai. We're seeing Viridian and Pyro. Yep, Viridian and Pyro. Uh, Pyro? Who's Pyro playing? Are you familiar with Pyro? Uh, my gut instincts wants to say Captain Falcon, but I'm not sure. I can see that. I can 100% see that. Yo, man, it is hot. It is hot in Topeka. Yeah, it is to, it is uh, hot. Take a walk here in a little bit. Before. Yeah, yeah, honestly, I think I think we need to take a little cool down yeah. walk, but we will be back with you guys soon. We'll go ahead and leave you on stream. Okay. Oh. Hold on. I thought it was cutting out for a second. I don't know. We are in losers round four. So I believe we're still best of, best of three territory, and Viridian like, versus uh, Pyro. Okay. Alright, enjoy y'all. We will be back. Gonna read up on Shoto's. I'm gonna put it down
I wrote the incinerator. Got back just in time. Nice. A perfect 2 0 by Pyro right there against Viridian. Sag. <laughs> okay. 
It might be the last old one. This Saturday? What's going on this Saturday? Uh, Steelcraft? Steelcraft. Oh, Melee Arcadian is at Steelcraft next month. Oh, so there's a Melee. Definitely down to check it out one of these days. Nice. Hell yeah. We, uh, we have seen some cross-pollination between the two games of Melee and Ultimate. Oh god, who are we watching right now? This is uh, Shangri vs. Abe for Winner's Final. We got the two uh, hottest players of tonight duking it out, and, and I think we're going to get the Fox versus the Game & Watch. And um, I think Fox is one of the few nightmares for Game & Watch, right? I can see it. Oh! 100%. Oh! It's loud, though. See? That much of a nightmare. <laughs> Wait, is this right? Gabe? Oh, yeah. Yep. Abe, and they are duking it out. Here we are, folks. Winners final on GS2. We got the... Dude, MSM is ripped because people stop going. It's way too expensive to run because people... Damn. Dude, and, and MSM was premiered as like, you know, just like one of the... I believe it happened like monthly or like every other week or something. Yeah. Uh, but after tournaments, like big top players will go. Like MK yeah. Leo has been a few, and just to run it. T3 Dom is like one of the mainstays. Larry Lur attends uh, MSM as well. Yeah. And oh man, this music is loud, but this match is banging as well already. Uh, Cloud is actually a character that I'm trying to pick up as well, so I'm very interested in seeing how A plays this uh, character. Because yeah, he does, he do play the lame game and watch. Now you're <laughs> playing a super hype swordsman. You're, you're, you're playing a, a femboy bioterrorist right now. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I like how you're like, you're not wrong. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> That's what some people call him. You're like, I've never thought of him like that. Until today. He's like a femboy genetic experiment. And a bioterrorist. And a bioterrorist. <laughs> a mercenary turned bioterrorist. Hey. A soldier turned mercenary turned bioterrorist. Damn, dude. Is that is that your arc, too? Oh, man. Very nice up till right there from Shangri to take My out Abe Stock. Farmer turned artist turned California. Nice. <laughs> Look at this. Abe doesn't seem like he knows what to do. He's not abusing that long sword by Cloud, there but even go. as I say that, <laughs> up smash, coming out, let her rip. Oh, man, beautiful punish. Wasn't able to get the immediate follow-up with a... Uh... Nice. Oh. Is Trippy getting married? Oh, okay, I see. Oh, yeah, yeah, you guys are, you guys are all having a whole conversation. Enjoy, enjoy. <laughs> I'm chilling out here. But Mercs is getting good at Melee. Hey, 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 that's what we like to hear. Yo, yo, Mercs, who do you who do you main? Are you a Fox main? Please don't tell me you're a Fox main. Well, well he was doing Dookie until he picked up Fox. <laughs> no, I don't actually know. Before I was doing Dookie. Oh, no, nah, that's DG's. Yep. Oh, okay. I thought I, it was about to be. Nah. Cl cloud player. <laughs> that was definitely GG's. I put him in Smash 4. I would say Fox is still kind of a nightmare for, for, for Cloud because like try, like the two framing capability that Wolf has is pretty ridiculous. Oh, yeah, yeah. You play Falcon Ganondorf, I, I respect the hell out of you, Mercs. You're a man of culture. Yeah, Hell yeah. Respect for sure. Hell yeah, Falcon Ganondorf. Nice. Get that limit break on deck. Just gonna keep it around and be fast. Yep, trying to use it for the ah. See, like I think he, he keeps trying to go for this fair to the cross slash, but it's not gonna work because Shangri is ready with the defense. Yep. Oh, and Slicer plays Falco and Falcon. All right. Nice. Just people of culture. Thank you. Because if you guys both would have said Fox, I would have snooze fest immediately. Snooze fest immediately. How do you feel about a Peach player? Oh hell yeah. We need we need more of them. But Peach, Peach is one of those characters that is so difficult to pilot. Oh yeah. yeah. Like to see a top representative, it's uh, it's very difficult. Well, that's because that's because I'm not playing the game. Yeah, yeah, that's why. That's why. <laughs> but like ever uh, ever since Armada, it's uh, it's been difficult to see a Peach like at, at very very high level. There's a yeah. uh, there's Lod, the guy who's the doctor. 
and he, and he actually plays like Peach yeah. like a very high degree. There's Triff, yeah, yeah. I believe is a Spanish player, and then there's Polish. And I think those are like the top three Peaches right now. And Hanky Panky. And Hanky Panky. <laughs> Don't forget. Don't forget. He may be gone, but not forgotten. Hello. Uh, you guys you guys both said Fox is lame and Fox is try hard. Hell and yeah. Boring to play. You guys are correct. Alright, Abe is uh, still very much using this forward air, but I think Shangri is very aware of what they Oh no. Oh no. Bro, I thought he was gonna wolf flash yeah, him. I, was I I thought he was gonna wolf flash him. I thought he was gonna take this like take his own stock just for the for the sauce. Maybe the good thing to do with Island to play is be like, if I know I can hit this, I won't. Yeah. Yeah. See what they do. hundred percent. Wow, my brain is changing. Ah, I see. I think, uh, I think for for you growing up, it's it's just like fighting game was mash. You know what? It's weird because for me growing up, I, in a lot of competitive games, I was told to let my younger cousins and stuff win. Yeah. So I was just like, all right, ah, I'm just mashing. I'm not gonna do it. Damn. I would still beat the crap out of them. I would get like in trouble if I didn't let them. Win. <laughs> so, I was like, I'm just being punished for being good. <laughs> All right, and a dash attack to take out the stock, but the percentage is looking kind of high. This is the trouble point that we have seen Wolf in, but, uh, ooh, good old dash attack right there. All right, we're going for the forward throw. Oh, and immediately to the dash attack. Good mix from Shangri right there, keeping it ambiguous enough so Ape can't respond. Keeping it ambiguous, even now, Ape trying to get that up tilt combo. Yeah. Ape Cloud? I mean, he's doing something. Yeah, he's, he's definitely trying to do something right now. He's, he's working it out. He's workshopping. Ooh, nice cross slash. I, do, I feel like Cloud is a better call for this than Neighbor Watch. A hundred percent, yeah. He's learning funding. <laughs> he's learning. I'm proud. Yeah. Hell yeah. He's learning fundies. <laughs> Game & Watch is not a fundies character. <laughs> you heard it here from Mercs, folks. There's definitely just characters in this game that... Oh, oh dude, he, he had to do the Spargo uh, limit up B. Uh, what is it, Climbing Hazard? Cl yeah, Climb Hazard. Oh, Climb Hazard? Yeah, he had to do the, the limit Climb Hazard to take out Shangri at that moment. That might but come back to bite him, honestly. Get the cross slash the wrong direction instead. He's a, he's a, he's a little committed to that cross slash for sure. Yeah. He's trying to he's trying to figure it out. Oh, that was a, a very sour back air nice. right there. Ooh, really nice fair. Out. Actually using the speed from the limit. Air dodging Ooh. out. Wow, nice. That's, he heard me. That's the one. He heard me. <laughs> that's the one. Hell yeah. That's, the Nero is back. That's the one. That, yeah. <laughs> you talking to me? Talking if, to if you guys have the chance, look at Shangri's player cam. You climb hazard in me? Yeah, he, he has one of the, the best, most intense looks at his face while he's playing this game. I've seen some players have nonchalant looks, others that are very like involved and like jerk at every moment. Yeah. And Shangri to me, he's got like, he's just got the stone cold face of like, what? What do you mean? What do you mean? Damn! What do you mean? Absolutely sweet spotted and demolished a quick JV2. That was a Shangri actually, you put uh, the point on Abe. For the first game? Oh wait, wait, never mind. I thought Abe won the first game and Shangri just won this game. Oh, he did? Am I wrong? I thought that was game one. That was game two. Damn, okay. <laughs> yeah. Really? Yeah. Shit. We already finished the game. Alright. Let's resume. <laughs> I mean, we'll know next game if I'm right or wrong. Or I guess the game after this one. Because right I thought... So he played Game & Watch? No, he played Clark. We watched two games already. Damn. Cool. Oh, wow. Ah, so he actually took I'm the I'm pretty first. sure, because I saw the cloud windscreen, and I clicked one on eight. Okay. All right, here, here we are. Shangri still sticking with the secondary. Fundies are gone. <laughs> we don't care about fundies anymore. And immediately, as soon as Game & Watch got clicked on, we lost viewership. <laughs> shout out! Shout out to all the people that respect and love themselves. Don't want to witness Game yeah. & Watch on this evening. We're only here for Cloud. I, to I totally understand. Cloud is so much hyper than Game & Watch. Fun die. <laughs> <laughs> True. <laughs> of course, the tried, the true. Down throw to the dash attack. Ooh, nice. I like that Shangri is uh, starting to use a bit of the, the falling up airs. Oh, 
Dude, the falling aerials are crazy. Oh, man. Jab lock to the F smash. Still not being able to kill. Wolf is a heavy boy. He's a bigger boy. Yeah, you gotta be careful not well, not wolf flash here. You're gonna. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. How, how, wow, was actually able to hit him through the platform. That's what Sora's move does for no reason. <laughs> There's other moves that do it. <laughs> oh, oh my God, he almost tricked himself in his own movement nice. right there. Yeah, actually, <laughs> I actually thought an SD was about to was about to happen at that moment. But he got back only to be bombed up. Ooh. Bomb and chair combo. Ah. Yeah, fun dies here. This is, this is where fun dies. Mmm. That's fun for someone. Mmm. Wow. You play Game & Watch? <laughs> <laughs> nice. Good interruption right there from Shangrai, but he's not able to get it in. He can't He can't begin the combo route. He just uh, continually is getting hit over and over. Oh, oh, man. Oh. Yeah. Nice. There, was, there was only so many times that you can re-grab ledge without getting punished, my friend, and that was about it right there. Ooh, an air to the dash attack, but so far, I think the most that we've seen is two to three hits. They should insert a uh, Game & Watch to the Anime Girl Smash meme. Huh? I don't think I'm familiar. I'm not on Smash Twitter, bro. <laughs> I think it's Smash X now. Oh, you play Game & Watch? We should talk about... Maybe I'm familiar with the format. But yeah, we've, we've seen fun come to die. Abe, uh, Abe looking a little dominant right now. I don't know if Shangri is going to be able to make this uh, make this climb back. Oh, he's just uh, died. He's throwing out these up yeah. smashes, bro. <laughs> that's uh, that, that's when you know Meister's feeling himself when he went when, once he starts like really yeah. holding those up smashes. It's like this has uh, some armor. Oh damn! I thought I thought that was death. Forward throw. Oh, down throw instead. Ooh. Wow. Nice. Absolute patience from Shangri, and he's going full Robert De Niro right now, dude. dude you buckled in my, my projectile? <laughs> I don't know what Robert De Niro is. Yeah, I was about to say, I was like, that was not Robert De Niro, but I'll, I'll, I'll run with it. Oh, goes for the for the back throw. Bro, that chair is destructive. All right, Abe moving up with a set advantage right now. 2-1 against Shangri. That game and watch seeming good. Seeming Honestly, good. cloud I like, is seeming good. I like the cloud. Yeah, I like the cloud. Let's see what he does here for a game. Bring it play. back. Bring it back. Fox cloud. Fox cloud. Fox cloud. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it, guys. Do it. I'll give you nothing. Nothing. Oh. And uh, pyro and neck love. Oh, pyro and neck love. That should be a banger for sure. Oh, dude, they got Blaziken in the game. I don't know if Blaziken plays. Falcon. Wow. Because the skin isn't working. Oh. Sad times. <laughs> Sad times. Yeah. Alright, we've returned to everyone's favorite. They should have put Blaziken in the game. It's Blaziken in the game would have been pretty cool, honestly. I could also see uh it's a lot of it's a lot of fire types, honestly. I mean, yeah. Yeah, that the, the, that I can see mostly being the, the game. fire fighting types. Yeah, that's like why. I could I, I, I could I could see Infernape. Oh man, Infernape would be sick, dude. Wow, he actually made it back. That was nice, but that spike I'm gonna call you out. Abe, you're ridiculous, bro. <laughs> you're actually ridiculous, dude. Like that was such an offstage scramble, and he still had enough composure to still spike Shangri. Nope. Nope. He's not getting phased at all. You're just gonna return to the nair loop. Just go, just empty your mind, dude. Just empty your mind. Nice. I just realized Shangri is actually going Fox now. Yeah. With that wolf color. Oh, you know what? I, I I got deceived pretty much. Yeah. It's like, oh, it's Wolf again. Yeah, exactly. And now and now it's getting hype. We are seeing Fox. You know, it's gonna be fast paced. But is Shangri gonna be able to turn the tides, or is Abe gonna be moving on to grand finals? Whoever uh, wins this will be moving on to Grands on winner side, which means they only have to win one set. If you are coming from losers, you will have to win two sets in Grand Finals to take home the trophy. And first place of tonight, Sink or Swim, 176. And honestly, it's looking like Abe's going to be on winner's side. Yeah, Abe is uh, not one to lose here. Nah. Winner's one of a lifetime. Definitely not. <laughs> The double roll yeah. on the platform. Yeah, you can call it lame, but it just means you don't know how to play the game, dude. Yeah. This is Game & Watch. 
I like exist in the game. It's oh, like, nice. custom combo. That was wow. sick. Honestly, I want to see more shine usage. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yo, was but that like shine, sweet spot back air right there? That was crazy. I didn't, I didn't expect that to kill. The shine isn't as good in this game at all. Nah, definitely not. They, uh, they, they for sure nerfed it. Yeah. But that's why I was surprised that. Oh, he's still, he's doing it off stage. Yeah. yeah, fire escape. Wait, what? What'd you guys call it? I don't know. Fire, fire, fire. Launcher. Who knows? Flamethrower. <laughs> fire punch. Oh, nice. Good old interrupt on the bomb. Wow. All right, Shangri is just juggling him right. No. Oh, I thought that was it right there. <clears throat> oh man, the tension is real. It is building up. Oh my God, they were at the same. Yo, percent. yeah, nearly equal percents right now. Wow, Shangri actually brought this back from the depths. What happened? Uh, Nice. And hell yeah. Shangri took this to a game nice. number five, brought out his Fox, decided to get serious about it. Ooh, Abe trying to level himself up. He's trying Stance to power up. up. He's trying to. <gasps> you know, we all tried to go Super Saiyan at a certain point, and that's what Abe's trying to do right now. Get in touch with the. Uh, go into Avatar State. Yeah. No more fundies, dude. No more fundies. No more fundies. The fun must die. Yeah. You must, uh, you must let go of physical attachment. <laughs> Don't be like Aang, bro. Give up on Katara. Release your inhibitions. <laughs> Feel the rain on your skin. <laughs> oh, oh, I thought... <laughs> I was about to pick Samus or something. All right, GS2. Oh, yeah, Samus. Yeah, dude, honestly, I am... Welcome to Shwetland. <laughs> oh, man. So we got a uh, Wolf Fox versus a uh, Green and Watch. Green and Watch. Dude, he uses that move at such perfect timings. That up B is ridiculous. Up B is crazy. If there's like top 10 menacing moves, that move would be like number eight, number seven. Like, it's for sure up there. What would be your number one menacing move? Number one, like most menacing move? Yeah, this guy. Uh, I'm. I need to think about it. Um, in <laughs> Incineroar. I think Incineroar has a lot of them. His his oh. Lariat is pretty menacing. The Alolan Whip. The Alolan Whip, of course, is pretty menacing. The... Honestly, Incineroar's Revenge. Yeah. It's like it's like once you hit him and you're like, oh shoot, <laughs> like what have I done? Off, uh... But yeah, I think I think if I had to give it to a character, I can't really narrow down the moves. It would yeah. be Incineroar. That makes sense. Because Incineroar is just one of those characters that, like, he gets his hands on you and you're like, oh. Yeah. Okay. If you let him, he can just do whatever. Yeah. He wants. You're like, this stock has been fun. <laughs> I'm gone. Yeah. Goodbye. I mean, of course, you can say the same thing about so many other characters in this game. Yeah. And that's something that you and I talk about all the time. Is like, people make a plane about this game, but it's, it's, it's pretty balanced. Yeah. It's pretty balanced. We've been able to see success with a lot of characters. And from I'm, what we see, is like these character specialists, they just got to put in time and yeesh. Yeah. I'll smash reaction right there. <laughs> yeah, I feel like any character can be good in this game. Mm -hmm. Really want to. Yeah, I mean, we've seen DK DK have success in bracket, and yeah. he's a heavy. You know, Chucky someone. Kong plays crazy with DK. Exactly, yeah, someone that gets bodied uh, a lot. I know uh, Hikaru out in Japan, he plays Roy, but also brings out a pocket DK. Akula also has a DK. Oh, yeah, you, uh, Akula actually brought out the DK against Spargo, dude. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. That was messed up. And he's also got a Luigi. Oh, the true Shoto main. No, he plays Steve. Yeah. Who am I thinking of that plays Luigi? Oh, that's, um... Why am I forgetting his name? He just got, like... Woo! Yeah, yeah, that's it for sure. And Abe closing it out in game number five. A little bit of devastation uh, sprinkled on the Shangri's plate, and we'll see how he can eat that season. And he's going to move down the losers where... Looks like Neck Love 3 0 Pyro and went on to loser semifinals. Next, I think we'll have AC versus Kali. And depending on who's the winner of AC versus Kali, they will move on to face off against Neck Love. So, folks, we're getting to the usual suspects of the night. You're going to see Abe up here. You're going to see Neck Love. You're going to see AC. You're going to see Kali. But uh, we do have the fresh face of Pyro, and that is great to see. Definitely want to see you out here at, uh, at more games. We do, we do love to see a, a little bit of Incineroar. Incineroar. 
that guy is a great character in this game. Mm -hmm. Like we were just talking about. But, uh... Uh... Super, super annoying. I would definitely say he's one of the like, most menacing characters. Who? It's in Aurora. Mm -hmm. What you were talking about. I feel sense. I feel like when it comes to heavies as a whole, they're just very simple characters. You know, it's like you can't overcomplicate it yeah. because of like what they got going on already. They've already got like huge hits, so you just yeah figure out how to use those huge hits for sure. Yeah, I mean like the for me currently like when I use Ganon, the only move that I consider to be broken on him is fair. Because that fist reaches far back. It's yeah. kind of like Bowser's, yeah. like, like in terms of how far, it, like, far back, back that. Here. Yeah, and, yeah. yeah. But Bowser's is great because it starts back here and goes down to his foot. Like, all, his all the way, yeah. We yeah. took a nice little coverall. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we got AC versus Kali. We'll go ahead and update it. Already got it set. And um, yeah, we're in best of five territory. So the first uh, player to three points, to three matches, will move on. Um, we've seen this uh, story a few times, y'all, and I think AC's ran away with it every single time. Right? Oh, yeah, against Kali. It's, yep. the, it's the, the buzz fate, man. We going random? Oh man, okay. I was about to say. I was like, wait, 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 wait. Like, huh? You know, I noticed his name is Fofa. Like, is that a is that a Bofa joke? Fofa these? <laughs> <laughs> like what? <laughs> We're on Schmattlefield. Oh, immediately starting off in disadvantage, just air dodging out. AC just immediately with the pressure. Playing some footsies for sure. Oh, see fussies. Wow, that's like one of the few times I've... <laughs> All right, he, he finally brought it out. That was one of the few times I've actually seen him use up air. Yeah. Wow, being uh, actually able to land the spike. Yeah, wow, look, look at that there. tether. Ugh. I'm getting hit with the yawn right now. Please ignore. Wow, the perfect positioning oh, of those PK fires, man. Look at that. Ah, oh, yeah. Deflected one of those PK fires with a side view of his own. Wow. For a bit. Yeah, he, he ain't no slouch, man. He's not just going to stand there and take every single projectile you throw his way. Crazy to see the answers that these players come up with for all the different situations. Right? It's like every character that you have will have an answer almost to like everything. You just got to find like what it is. Yeah. That is the, the, the beauty of the game. I feel like you could definitely get mad and understand that a matchup is bad, but it's like you also get to a certain point where it's like, no, nah, I can do something. There's something. Wow. <laughs> Cheese. Cheese. We're going for the queso right there. That's a, that's some good old cheese dip. Seven layer cheese for sure. Oh, man. Dude, I thought he was going to land it a second time. <laughs> Hold up, AC playing kind of a irrational, kind of impatient right now, and Kali loves that. I, I don't think I don't think you want to give that to him, AC. I don't think you want to give that to him. We're running around, he he's, will find the opening. He's definitely improved a lot as a player during our time of uh, commentating here. Yeah, we. I think Kali is definitely the player we've seen with the most growth, 100%. Yeah, I would say so. Mm -hmm. It's it's interesting to see the other players because I feel like they've just picked up other characters. Wow. Nice. Run up with grab to one of the slowest up smashes in this game. It was broken in the previous game, but uh, but let's not talk about it. I love I loved using Lucas up smash. <laughs> it was faster in the last game. It felt like it for sure. It was still pretty slow. Yeah. Wow, look at that, dude. He's empty jumping, just th throwing out the up airs. I like it. He's just staying in place. He doesn't have to do much right now. AC is the one that has to catch up from behind. So we can just kind of hang out. Chill Ooh. Out. Nah, bro. He's, 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 in the, he's, in the, he's in the blender. If AC's serious, he's going to bring out the snake. <laughs> right. Nah, from uh, from my understanding, I'm... Mate, mate. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, hey, he, he was doing something. But if, if we understand something about AC is that he knows that when people stall off stage, he's going to capitalize oh, on yeah. that and punish it. He's just, like, waiting for you to actually start using your recovery moves and then... Yeah, because like, because the only time he was actually able to take out Shangri was uh, when he was shine stalling off stage, yeah. and then he would actually get him. Oh man, he's just trying to position himself, just consistently jumping, going for fares. Absorbed a little bit of his health back. Ooh, snake and tether. 
Oh man! Dragged off the, with the Ooh. spike. Game one to Kali. Kali was waiting for that, dude. Yeah. You saw how excited he got as soon as he had that. He had that on lock. That was clean yeah. gameplay from Kali. We'd love to see it. We're all cheering on Kali right now. We'd love to see the growth, the glow up. That was a sick ending. We've seen it happen many a times in bracket. Kurt, did you get hit by that when you played uh, Kali? Yeah, for sure. Uh, uh, a thousand percent. <laughs> <laughs> that and the back air. Yeah. He messed me up. What I got hit with the most was the neutral air drag to the edge of the stage to down air. Uh, and I was just like, oh, I messed up. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, man. The option so like you immediately got grabbed. Oh, no. He fell out. Yeah, that's the idea. Uh, I wonder if like the floatiness is uh, something that really messes with Joker right here. For sure. I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> oh no. And these hops. Bro, these spot dodges too. He's getting clean. Yeah, he is he is hopping a lot and uh AC isn't really doing anything to stop him from doing these hops right now. You gotta you gotta condition him, kid. <laughs> I'm saying it over here like it's super simple. I'm commentating. I didn't even join bracket. Don't 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 listen to me. I would get conditioned as well. Oh yeah. Yeah. Look at that. Just just be reversed. Didn't move in. Woo! Let's go. We love to see it. The confirms. It makes me go monkey, dude. No, I thought he landed it twice. This is death, right? Oh no. Back here is not as strong as this. Wow, bro. The 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 Quiso. Oh, I thought that was it as well. You know what, uh, Kali, I love the vision, and I respect it, and that's that's all I want to say. Everything you were doing is valid and fair. We're hearing some people definitely have uh, some adverse reactions. Ooh! Okay, I've never seen the, the, the third hit actually uh, shield poke. That was really cool. Nope. I mean, what are you going to do? You got to get him off stage. Nice. Nope, oh, but the dash attack is still not enough. You need Big Brother in order for that dash attack yeah. to mean something. Yeah. Nice, man. Kali's defense. Yeah, really, really, the uh, stage. yeah. Utilizing the wow. shield, the spot dodges, the evasive maneuver of just jumping around. I like it. He's doing great. Huge improvements all around. Fourth throw? Oh, okay. It was a fourth control. throw kill. I don't think any throw would have killed there, right? You probably got to be in, like, in the 200s to kill with the Joker grab. If he was like facing the other way and back through, it mm. probably would have killed. Oh, okay. That's the only way I know. Or maybe up throw. Mm -hmm. I don't know. But even with up throw, you gotta be. Ooh! Oh, man, that, that quickly could have been a very dangerous situation, but we're just throwing buttons out here. Oh. On stage. Ooh! Nice oh, whoa. Custom combo. Clip that. Clip that. That was nice as hell, Kali. We're seeing Shangri with the custom combos, Kali with the custom combos. Woo! Custom combo central. He's got his number right now. What's AC gonna do to retaliate? Big Brother didn't do anything. He did nothing. Oh man. Nah, just using a lot of gun and evasive maneuver, but Kali's still maintaining the lead right now. Alright, being able to delay his uh, his getup. What is that? Like a, a grappling hook? Like what is it? Yeah. Oh, it's a grappling hook? Okay. Wow. Up tilt didn't actually kill right there. Very rare move that we don't see used by Lucas too much. It's, and that finally taking it out. Uh, Joker extended his arms and his uh, his buttons got punished. Caught that hand with the F tilt of psychic power. He's trying to bait him. He's trying to bait him right now. He's like, hey, I'm PK freezing. You wanna I'm, you wanna rush in, don't get you? In here, get in here. I'm PK freezing. Come on, come on, dude. It's a party, man. Yeah, it's a party. Don't worry about it. Ooh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my. Wow. Dude, Kali is on one right now. What is going on? Dude, are they holding your family hostage? Like, why are you playing so hot right now? What? Oh, he wanted it. He wanted it. That, wow. He got me. He got me. I thought I would have landed the two frame, and then he absolutely schmicks me. Just destroyed. It's getting tense. It's getting tense, even though Kali's still got the two stocks. For sure. 
That's so close. And oh man, absorb that in. Going for the back air. Oh man, just using a little bit of random gun, but is Joker, can Joker make this? Oh man. With, uh, with what Lucas has got on I know, deck. I know AC is a great player, but this is a deficit. Yeah. And yeah, Andy next to a sneeze <laughs> could take you out. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah sorry, sorry. Lu uh, Lucas just sneezed. That's a 2 0. And now we see commitment to the Joker. Do you actually want to learn this character? <laughs> or are you trying to win in bracket? Yeah. And you go to Snake. I thought he was about to pick a Snake song. Yeah, he's going to play Snake Ear. <laughs> snake Ear Metal Solid. <laughs> oh, I said Snake Eater. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Metal Snake. Oh, me Metal Snake. Metal Snake, yeah. yeah. Alright, cool. Nice. This was uh, one of the characters that we did uh, mention earlier that uh, AC definitely do have in his pocket. Hold on. Sweating, dude. Yeah, man. I don't, want to coke. I don't want to coke these chairs. It's too late. It's true. It's true. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Does he know how to play against Meta Knight? Uh-oh. Just a smaller hitbox, but man... I feel like he's going to land a filthy spike. He's yeah. going to land a filthy spike on him. Uh-oh. He knows. He knows. He's not worried about it. He's not worried about it. He was trying to land that filthy spike already. Oh, yeah, yeah. Look at the, the, the confidence <laughs> levels are very high. Disadvantage. Dis, dis, dis. Oh, nice. He was actually able to, I think he uh, canceled that. Actually able to move out of that pretty fast. If he uses both of these. He's using both of these brain cells. Yeah, yeah. Fo, fo <laughs> I have both of these brain cells. That's good. Ooh, wow. Oh, Trying to use the B reverse. That was a clean B reverse off ledge. Yeah. Woo a, little, a little ledge slip. A little ledge slip action. A little, a little cancel. Nah, AC was trying to get tricky. Wow, the patience. Woof. He was trying to get tricky with it. Nah, bro, dude. Defense diligence. I think we're... Woo! Nice. Kali. Oh, man. Dude, Kali got me clapping over here, tilt. bro. It's crazy. I, I just clapped instinctively. <laughs> he's, he's, on a, he's on a new one for sure. He definitely wants to move on in bracket. For sure. I, who, uh, I can't blame who, who brought Kali down to losers? Do you remember? Uh, we watched it, didn't we? Did we? Yeah, I already forgot. Eight. Ah, yeah, well, yeah, we totally did watch it. Yeah, even then, it was a, it was a two zero, but it was close. You know, unlike the three one that we just witnessed before, that one did not feel close. All right, all right, all right. The usual shenanigans. How many up airs can you land in a row? And if it isn't seven, then you know, you should be ashamed. <laughs> At least eight, I feel like. Nah, there's no way you're gonna get that two frame. Dude, the falling upper, I love it. It just adds so much shield damage. It actually like knocks it like so low. Ooh, used dimensional cape, but it did not kill. That move, uh, that move looks swaggy as hell, but sometimes is it's it's it disappointing. It's kinda whack. Yeah, it is kinda whack, honestly. I, f I feel like it's better for movement than it is for like the actual yeah. damage. Nah, bro. Circles are being danced upon, and it's like they're both two stocks, but I still feel like Holly's been in control. <laughs> yeah. Like, he may have gotten up to 106, but he's been in control of this pace in this match. That's for sure. Oh, Ooh. man. The confirms from Kali, dude. Yeah, AC is these, 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 these combos where he's just landing two hits, three hits, four. Like, ooh, good call out right there. Thought he was going to panic jump, but yeah. actually just went for the F smash. Now this is where your grit gets tested. You're up 2-0, it's final stock. Can you clean it out, make this a 3-0? Or are you gonna go the whole game five route? Uh-oh, uh-oh. We'll have to see what's, uh... Oh. Yeah, what he... Like do about this. Oh man, we get a hit with the yawns. Since it's our first time back, we will be heading out a little earlier, y'all, but we do uh, appreciate y'all joining us for the journey. We are building up the tolerance once again, because we are EP boys. Very EP. I, I, I like don't even want to drink that anymore. We usually bring an energy drink to keep us here, but honestly, the action. No, nah, I'm kidding. I'm still EP. <laughs> I mean, it's, it has been great, really amazing yeah. stuff, uh, especially seeing colleagues run here at Losers. And this is the first time that we've seen AC with a verifiable lead. Uh oh. Wow, yes. he made it. Wow, being able to grab ledge. Now you can see it. He's on the prowl, dude. He smells blood right now. Yeah. 
Ooh. Immediate jump call out right there. Beautiful. <laughs> wow. Uh-uh. Nah, Kali. Oh my god. Dude, Kali with the call outs right now. Turn into Mario. <laughs> <laughs> From Mario. <laughs> yeah. Fair got me sounding like Tanuki. Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> and that'll be it right there. AC takes the game with his Meta Knight, and it looks like that's going to be the character he plays. Just look at the way Kali looked over at him. He was like, really, dude? Really? Are you happy? The cheese. Like, are you happy? Like, does that... Do, do you wake up and you're you like, can't yeah. win with Joker, though. You can't win with Joker. <laughs> <laughs> Immediate petty comment. Yeah. <laughs> Dang. Look at all these songs. Yeah, dude. look at these songs. Land of the Kais. Oh, yeah. This is my favorite Pokemon song. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> from Pokemon Z. Yeah, from Pokemon Z, dude. Pokeball Z. Yeah. Piccolo is totally a, a Pokemon. I think I was a fan of Pokeball dude, GT. Honestly. Piccolo lays eggs. Don't tell me this. <laughs> he lays eggs. Don't tell me this. Yeah, dude, he's a Pokemon. He's into eggs. <laughs> we won't we won't get any further into that. Let's dissect this uh, Meta Knight gameplay right now. Oh, and actually, is he using... Is this the first time we see the outfit against AC? Yeah, but... Man, this outfit is messed up. He's supposed to have a coat on. Oh, is it, like, actually lore accurate? Yeah, it's from Mother 3. Oh, okay. Damn. It's, um... Uh oh! I won't tell you too much else. Like you're ever gonna play Mother 3, it's like it was never released in <laughs> English. Until they put it on the, the Switch Virtual Console. Nice. Wow, nice tag right there. Hold up, I need to go use the restroom For again. Sure. Just gonna sit here and study up the. Oh, nice. Yeah, he's got those down edge to F smash, like, on lock. Nice, yes. Fishing a little bit for that back air, but hey, if it works, you know, you can't blame him. Basically, okay, so try to keep him off stage, get those early kills a little bit. Cool. This energy drink got me bilch. Oh my god. Alright, well, let's see. Probably doing a great job of just reading AC's options and the up throw kills at that percent. Man, I don't know Lucas. Get those pokes in. Dimensional cape to break the shield. Just a quick little F smash. Get the stock gone. Even and out. Back to zero. We are restarting this set. Or this game. Game four. Nice. Just back in neutral. Hanging out. Getting those pokes. <laughs> Man, this game is uh, pretty even already consistently. But uh, AC coming through with those up air strengths, getting Kali up to uh, some mid percents here. Let's see how Kali answers this. Replies back with some combos of his own. Get that percent up some more. <laughs> Dude, me and the boys shielding mid stage. Nice. <laughs> Dang, man, I can throw out moves. He's so, his frame is frame data. It's pretty good. And shield, nice spot dodge. Gonna follow up on that down tilt as well. Yeah, yeah. He's not gonna let you recover like that easy anymore. It seems like those first two games, or first, yeah, the first two games was an AC just kinda hanging out, chilling, testing out the Joker. Midnight is where he's trying to really bring it back, but. Whew. Let's see if Kali has the willpower to win this and get through losers bracket even more. Could be going up against the next love next in semifinals. Woo. Nice, but that down air spike can carry him off the stage, but wow, Meta Knight for sure gonna recover from that. Yeah, I think it's been that way. It's been like that the whole time? Just from the little bit that I've seen, but I wasn't sure if it was just my connection on the phone. Yeah. Nice. All right. Bring back down to one sock. Again, it's it's exactly what I was telling you, man. It was either three zero or we're going to game five. Yeah. The Meta Knight has made an adjustment. It doesn't look like that Joker is completely ready for Kali just yet. But how else is he going to train the Joker, you know? 
It's true, but he didn't want to lose. <laughs> yeah, that's his gas money tonight, bro. Yeah, I was gonna he's, say. Uh, yeah, yeah, he's, he, <laughs> he's trying to make his gas money back. Get that check. Yeah. Like, yeah, dude, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get my thirty-two dollars. Like, what? Pay my energy bill. Man. Yeah, <laughs> my energy bill. <laughs> There's no way your energy bill is just thirty dollars. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Trying to be a little feistier with the movement. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Nice. Wow, okay. And now, here we are, folks, in Game, Game 5. Oh, wow. I got I got nominated. Yeah. My Allison. I don't know. I just saw that. That's funny. <laughs> so I just said that. I'll wait, say wait, wait, wait. I'll I'm say I don't read as fast as you. Oh, my bad. Oh, wait, wait. The most more accurate. Uh, to our crew. I won't elaborate. <laughs> I'll steal our jokes from media. I'm gonna put a thumbs down to that myself. From what? To Dory. Don't we all steal our jokes from media? <laughs> Just immediately th thumbs it all down. Just like, no. All right. Not me. We immediately made it back. Kali was taking the lead, but now we're going on a trip, bro. The merry-go-round. It begins with Meta Knight. We go up and we go down. Oh, man. It's like as soon as you introduce a sword into the equation. Like, a, da a dagger won't cut it. Yeah. A dagger won't cut but it. But, like, uh, twice the size sword. Yeah. Ooh. Nice. Nice, but the, the DI definitely getting a lot cleaner from... Oh, no, that's desperation. Oh, what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah, bro, if you if you missing that, then, then, then the considered GG is shake his hand already. <laughs> but we'll, we'll have to see how Kali brings us back up. Nice. The immediate get up to the fair. Oh, oh he, he wants it. it. <laughs> he wants it. Give me the spike. <laughs> now, now, I, now I feel cringe and want to unsend all this, but I'm just going to... I'm just gonna accept it. It is what it is. They're your friends. They're not friends. They won't see you as friends. True. If you guys ever think you're cringe, ask your friends. <laughs> and if they say yes, get new friends. Get new friends. <laughs> yeah. True. Actually, very true. Just be around people that are like you. And don't give in to group things. Those are the, 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 wow. two, the two main life, points. Life lessons with Curb. <laughs> Curb sessions with Curb. Think for yourself, but also. But also play Kirby. <laughs> As a Sora main, I play Kirby. As a Sora main, <laughs> I play like Kirby and don't play Kirby. Yeah. I mean, imagine me going with my name Namek and I don't play Piccolo. <laughs> and fighters. Yeah. yeah. But I actually did play Piccolo also. Wow. Yeah. Who else you play? Piccolo. Um, Goku. Always, always to some capacity. I was never a Vegeta guy. Uh, yeah. Piccolo, and then the third I would always switch up. I like um, Baby. I like I like Kid Buu. Yeah, I think Kid, Kid, Kid Buu would be my third. I think that's it, no? Yeah. Uh, you know, you know when both players simultaneously like wipe their face like with their hand, it's like there's an agreement being made yeah. of like ah, like that was that's unfortunate. Yeah. Nope. Ah man. It's it sucks to see. You hate to see it, but it just is what it is right now. AC trying to go for the mix right there and opting to go for the tornado, which would have killed if you hit it initially. Like, I'll, yeah. Okay, maybe. <laughs> I mean, he he does have an extra stock. He's saying it. He's chilling. I just want him to, to to bring out a random up smash and just completely explode Meta Knight for a yeah. quick second. Nice. Nice. I think Kali wants that wants those spikes so so much. So much. they're very satisfying. Yeah. Like like Lucas does have very like I, nice. I fully understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh yeah. at a certain point. It's 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 the same with like Falcon, like DK, yeah. Ganon. It's like all their spikes are very satisfying, but it's obvious. Yeah. You know, like of like, course I know you want this. Of course they want to go for the spikes. Yeah. Oh. And the neutral air? Wow. Okay, not gonna do it just yet. PK Thunder at, actually hit him with the PK Cannon, going with the down air, trying to go for it in two loops. He's getting pressured, actually parries. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, oh what's the punish? He's learning? We're in triple percents right now. The adaptation from both players has been crazy. 
Oh, oh my God. that was a sweet spot. Again. It's getting hectic. No way. It was in AC's hands, and now Kali has brought this back from the depths. Who is going to close it out right now? Oh, no. No matter which way this goes, this is going to be a heartbreak for either player. Oh, dude, that Nair. That Nair is coming out a lot. Oh! Nice. And oh Kali God. clutched it out. It took it in a game five situation. <laughs> Eliminating sure AC from the tournament. Oh, nice. oh man. <laughs> Hell yeah. That was awesome, man. Props to Kali. Tense. And Kali with the pop off as well. Well deserved. That was tense. Dude, man. good stuff to him. Wow. Oh my God. Wow. Oh my I am God. sweating from the action, and, uh, from the anticipation. He's going to go up against the neck love next. Yeah. But I think this is uh, where we're going to go ahead and leave y'all. So thank you so much for tuning in. Slowly building up that tolerance, but it's great to see y'all. It is hot in here. But just to remind everyone, this is Game Sync, where it is hosted both Sync or Swim and Sync Up Saturdays. So on Thursdays and Saturdays, please make sure to come play some Super Smash Brothers. It starts at 7 p.m. And also on Fridays, there's Synchronicity, where uh, it's a batch of anywhere from Street Fighter 6, Guilty Gear Strive, or Tekken 7. And best I believe think, Tekken 8 is going to yeah. be played once it gets released. And, I think uh, they're mostly doing Guilty Gear and Street Fighter. Yeah, right now. and it seems like right now the biggest bracket is for sure mostly for Street Fighter 6. So if you oh, hop okay. on the sticks, if you play all, all skill levels, we welcome them all. Please come through and Just enjoy. No Rashids. No Rashids. No, dude, you're going no to be a Rashid secondary. What do, you, <laughs> what do you mean? He's broken, dude. Like, yeah. He's actually messed up in that game. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and drop it in here for you guys one more time. Techni is the lovely sponsor of today. Oh, Curb, real quick, if you want to show these chairs. Oh, it's actually the, the chair that you see in stream. Uh, is Make sure to use code GAMESYNC for 10% off. So many different styles. The Geo Series, the Kawaii style, the Moo later. Honestly, or Moo now. Super later. sturdy. Yeah. And uh, what's impressing me the most right now is... What, what, what is this called? The, the armrest? Yeah, the armrests. For me, like, the armrests are a big deal. Yeah. I use actually. them a lot, especially, like, in my chairs. That's what, and they're super adjustable. You can change them up, you know? That's great. Yeah, so so definitely check it out. These are beautiful chairs, so we appreciate it for Techni. But this is us signing off, so we're going to go ahead and leave you guys on stream. Uh, make sure we're updated. I'll put it back to With Kali, to Neck Love. But Just hang out here. Yeah. Thank you all we'll so much. Peace. What's up, everybody? Kali beating AC? That's crazy! Just to fight Neck Love in the next round. Kali's got to cool off after that, and I understand. Oh wait, Slicer's in here? What's up, dude? I don't know if he's still in here, but... 
see him in the chat. Battle. Lucas M. Three, ready for two, you. bring it one, on. go.
Battle! Focus! Oh, 
Let's go, Drip Wolf versus Violent Ken. Ah, yeah. 
really can win.
Strike. Swap Strike. 